All right, Shalom. Shalom. This is uh, GMS New Orleans coming at you uh, from one of our other locations, man. You know, uh, we always do when we start off by giving if not, if praise to your house. I'll 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 Away from all the bullshit, you can't, you can't even get downtown, man. But we, you know, we here. Like I said, we are, as we always say, we teach the scriptures to you, so-called Negroes, like those Native Americans, the elective youth, man. Right? These people on this side, all right. Two thirds of them will be destroyed according to uh, according to the Bible, all right, because of their because of their transgression to the Most High and their wickedness, right? These are these are the uh, other other people of the Lord that's uh, slated for destruction. Right, right along with your nations, who we are here to teach in the prophesied to, to tell you what, what's, what's your judgment in the future, in the near future, to be honest. All right, but as we uh, as we you know, we stand here today, you know, we here to also to prophesy. The best thing we can do now is to prophesy of the coming destruction, all right, the coming uh, uh, major events of the MOTB, which is the mark of the beast, all right, or the value, the uh, uh, I said uh bear chip right these are the things that, that have to come out to warn two thirds you give me that in ezekiel i think that ezekiel three i got you to warn ezekiel three right yeah i got yeah. it the warn the war in the house of israel right yeah. which is our which is our uh which is our our thing to do now to get the blood of our of our head right and we're here we're here to warn you all right that as you know it this society as you know it whether the hustle and bustle of making money, commerce, business, all right, uh, the rioting of having fun, partying. Like right now, you go into our spot. If you can get to our spot downtown, you got you got niggas galore, partying, bullshitting, in that uh, in that what? Uh, that right bucket, that reveling bucket spirit, drunk, capa dogs, <gasps> niggas doing all that shit right now downtown. We didn't get. We just did that shit already, brother. Like y'all brothers came, we did that, done that, you know. Yeah. <clears throat> Getting into it with Kappas and Q Dog niggas. All right. <laughs> we did that shit already, man. That? Somebody gonna get killed though. <laughs> Somebody gonna get killed tonight. All right, but we didn't did that, done that, you know. And uh you don't you don't get nowhere, you know, teaching those niggas, man. They they don't want they don't want this truth. You know, they just wanna they just wanna uh watch some niggas run down the field behind the pig skin. And collide and collide their uh the helmets together to get CTE. All right. We're here to give you the truth, man. All right, that the Lord's the Lord's finna all this shit that you see by your classic, the holidays, the Lord's finna destroy all this shit, man. All right. Go ahead. The ugly ass truck. <clears throat> this, Go ahead. This is Ezekiel 3 and 17. Son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Yep. Therefore, hear the word at my mouth and give them warning from me. Yeah, and what's we're which we're slated to do to give warning to the house of Israel, all right? To lift up this banner, as the scripture says, blow the trumpet, all right? <clears throat> warn my people, and we give you the warning that the Lord's finna, the Lord's finna use the so-called white man, all right, to slay two thirds of the nation of Israel through martial law, Jacob's trouble, all right? <clears throat> the coming destruction, the coming famine of the word, the coming actual famine. Of bread and water. These things that we we speak on are not nothing that's far off. It's not far fetched. These are things that are very real. These events that are coming are very real, and they line up with biblical prophecy. Man, go ahead. Hey, that's the spirit. The psychotrope just passed by because who's behind that? Elon Musk, that's it. who's uh, in Trump's administration, and we know what he's dealing with: the Neuralink, the Neuralace, and then Trump. He looks like he's going to be that cruel Lord in uh, Isaiah chapter 19 because got the immigration issue where he's talking about getting the military involved and he's talking about cutting food stamps and other welfare benefits oh, as well. Please, Baba Gashai, y'all remember a couple of months back, y'all one of y'all brothers had the, the article with him saying when he get in office, he's going to use the firing squad. He's going to use all those instruments, instruments of cruelty that it, it was once used back then. All right, so he's very well might be that that crew lord that that nero 
All right, you got Edomites calling these guys Nero, man. All right, we we just jokingly say it, you know, because we don't know, but we jokingly say, oh, the guy guy could possibly be Nero. All right, y'all remember that? You remember the article? Uh, it should be easy to find. It says he was the firing squad. Trump <clears throat> brother put in Trump. Trump talks about bringing back old forms of execution. And the thing about this, this uh, Louisiana governor, that's his boy too. So guess what he brought back? He brought back old Sparky. Castrations. Yeah, castrations. You know what Sparky is, right? That's that electric chair, man. That's that chair you used to put on you niggas' head. You get that sponge, wet your head, put that cape over your head, and put that that that, that electric crown on your head, man, and strap you in the chair. And he and the, and the guard do this. Okay. Boom. And then the next thing you know, you up there smoking. They're bringing that back for you niggas, man. This nigga said, I use giving you 85. You got to do 85% of your time here in, in, in Louisiana now. Oh, 100%. My bad. It's no shortcuts. No shortcuts. I use it. As, he said, I use it as a deterrent. So you niggas still want to play with this man? That's in draconian measures coming. Yeah. And in the, in the end, in the first part, I don't know if you saw that article, the, the ankle bracelet thing, the judge said they're not doing that no more because a lot of crimes been happening. Yeah. Well, Jake been cutting the ankle monitors off or wait till they go dead and then they'll go do crimes, uh, violent crimes. Right. Like murder, different things like that. So the judge said that something has to come in place, especially with these mistress monsters, these juveniles. They're basically saying, look, they can't, you know, the, the, the the ankle monitor is not helping uh keep Jake at home or at bay. You got it. Like Trump, what, what's the best <laughs> measure for that? <laughs> what is the best measure for that? Putting the chip in the nigga ass, man. Yeah, that's nice. That's the best thing. Just they cut, they cut the ankle monitors, they yeah. do crimes. We're, we're wasting a lot of money. Yeah. A lot of money. A lot of money. A lot of money being wasted. <laughs> Let's just chip them. It's gonna chip you. It's gonna chip. It's gonna yeah, chip so, in the head. I, my friend, that's not here. The ship is it's, it's tremendous. It's it's tremendous. Yeah. We'll be able to track everybody. What's the what's the point of having you even had that guy, Dr. Oz? Now you're putting musk in there like what do you think he's getting ready to do? Go look at uh Dr. Oz track record, man. And and, and Dr. Oz, Elon Musk, and Trump, why you think they've been around since we were a little boy in the media? God. They've just been around floating all this time, bullshitting, even uh kill gates. Yeah, yeah. Yep. This nigga, well, this nigga this nigga. Took the ideas of uh uh Microsoft. Microsoft, they do they know a fucking thing about computers. I'm like, they gave that shit to him. He's a gutter rat, man. But this guy always been floating around. Then all of a sudden now, since they had the, they, they 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 feel that they had the the, the crowning the, the at the gates of their uh enterprise. So what they doing now? All those people are starting to align to why they was always sitting around lingering, man. These people are gonna these people are the ones that's gonna usher in this new world order. All right. Uh, the article. Yeah, yeah. Let me get it. Let me, let me give it to this bird. Time. Uh, and this is a. Uh, it's an article from from Verdict. Dot com. It says Donald Trump wants to use the fire squad, mass executions, and videos to turn executions into reality TV. Come on, Baba Gisha. And what? And what Nero was into? Do anybody know what Nero was into? When Nero was walking early, Jaconi Law. Look, look, a little bit more. He said it. He was into thin. What Donald Trump was into? Reality TV. Right? That same spirit is subject to the same man. Whatever he was doing in his panel, he's gonna come back doing the same thing. Or something very close to it. Might call it a different name. You got theater, you got reality TV, the same thing. You know what you're about to say? I was gonna say if if Nero if they had reality TV back in ancient Rome, Nero would have been at the forefront of it because he he hung out around celebrity. You know, he hung out around entertainers, Nero, uh, you know, actors, you know, circus people, which was looked down upon because an emperor is not supposed to be dealing with the common folk. And what did Donald Trump do? Same. He hanging with the same celebrity. He just was at the UFC fight when John Bon Jones kicked yeah. that guy's head the fuck off. With Aiden Ross. Uh, <laughs> what the thing that he went to? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All that stupid shit, man. All right, so it's the, it's the same thing going on, man. You just gotta put on the spiritual spiritual goggles to see. All right, but it's saying this guy's gonna bring what? Fire squads, mass executions, 
and videos to turn the executions into reality TV. And we told you, it's funny that uh, I was trying to find that old paper I had, but as I'm trying to find a paper, a possible wrong, a possible boy made the video talking about the same guy, the same paper I was looking for. It was a guy back then by the name of Tex Mars, mm. all right. And, and that move in the, in the documentary Tex Mars had, he you remember that paper I had? It said they're gonna use thumb screws. They they're gonna use thumb screws on your ass. Called Martial Law USA. Or something. Yeah, Martial Law. Yeah, it says uh, Martial Law USA. Uh, gulag, Gu gulag, you guys like you say, kind of when you use thumb, thumb screws, Scr uh, power drills, power drills, counter prongs on you, skull crushes. All right, they're gonna jack you. You gonna jack a lot of you jakes up in these end times, man. All right, this man ain't bullshit. Get a little, give me a little more. All right, it says, uh, Trump has a Trump has a three part that just said it'd be like mad men sparing enough. It says, it's like an Trump uh -huh. has a, a three part plan to heighten the drama of state killing. First, he would like to have the federal government use the firing squad, hanging, or even a guillotine when it puts people to death. Yeah, even the guillotine. And they already have a, uh, a house bill that's already been passed years ago for the guillotine. All right, there's already been, there's already been uh, eyewitnesses that was on, on these ships coming from China of uh, nothing but Get things on the board, on the on the board of the uh, the ships coming over here. That was doing the Obama, uh, Obama administration. Obama administration, man. Yeah, uh, DHS. Yep. Back then, bought over a million plus how uh, how Hundreds of millions. FEMA. Yeah. Why 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 is it when I was coming in the truth back then, FEMA bought over millions of coffins, plastic coffins, oh, yeah. plastic bags. What that's for? What is this event that they plan on doing that they, they never came out with it yet? But what is this event that they've been storing up plastic bags for, man? You know, they're going to do mass, like the brush said, mass genocide, man. I was going to say it in this thing. Go ahead. It says, uh, second, he thinks it should carry out mass executions by killing many people at one time. Yes. That's the plans, man. Whether he, whether he comes out and says, that guy, that guy, hey, you, you, you I'm going to say something. You've really studied the ancient Roman Empire. Do you really think, do you really think Alexander the Great was in power, or was it somebody behind him, powering him? The same thing was going on back. The same thing going on today was going on back then. You have a, you have a government behind a government, man, mm -hmm. telling them what to do. And if he don't fucking listen, what happens to him? Yeah. You get the Leo, Leo, what is it? Lee Wall, Oswald, Oswald, Harvey, Harvey Oswald, is what yeah. You just say you get the JFK treatment, man. You get the uh you yeah, yeah pop your top, man. Gotta hit that pop. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, you get that type of action when you don't listen. You know, anybody say? I was just gonna say, I saw a title of a video on YouTube called Many Romans thought the first triumvirate was a conspiracy. And back in ancient Rome, you had the senators in the Senate House. Behind the scenes, you had something called the first triumvirate, which was uh Caesar, Julius Caesar, Pompey, and Crassus who were pulling the strings behind the scenes, but that was considered a conspiracy back in ancient Rome. Yeah, Alexander the Great and them guys, they were just a face of the Roman Empire. They just put him up there. It's like Greeks. that fucking uh, Greeks, my bad. He's just the face of it. He's like American. You put a president up there, he's just the face of America. It's not the guy who's running the company, actually running the company. You're just the president of the company, but you ain't the D guy, all right? Those guys stay in the shadows that you'll never even see nor hear from them. Right, and don't and don't tell me, oh, the guy burned up two days ago in the house fire. You know, that's some bullshit, man. All right, go ahead. Uh, we got a little more. Yeah, last one. It says third, he would like to film and broadcast at least some part of the execution process. Yeah, that's it, though. Yeah, and like I say, place that we live at New Orleans, they used to have they used to have executions on Canal Street, mm -hmm. live executions. They used to literally have a stage. The 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 the. The, the lynch, the lynching, uh, uh, rope. Yep. You have that hole in the floor. Yeah, get everybody pumped up and drop that shit. That nigga just a bag on them over yeah. their heads. It's over with, man. So if, if the history of America was about that back then, you think you think they'll shy away from it now? Which people? I'm gonna say this: the people, people from uh from the beginning of time, all right, especially going into the Gre Greco-Roman Empire. People love gore. 
They love blood. They love uh, cuts and bad. They love that shit. Why you think the UFC became so big? Submitting a guy, putting a guy in trouble, snapping a guy, twisting a guy arm until his fucking snaps. Why you think? Why you think the Coliseum was so big back then? It's the same thing today. Especially if especially if this guy can make it, he can make it a uh, make it a thing to where it's uh. Sit at your home and watch. Sit at your home and it's monetized. Yeah, you can bet on it. Yeah, the sit time and make it a make it a oh. thing. We got real fans when really die. People will tune in for that shit, you know. They will tune in for that shit, man. <clears throat> How much you give me? How much? Ten million? Oh yeah, come on, sign me up. You know, give me that. This is a uh, second entry of 16, start of 70. For there shall be in every place and in the next city a great insurrection upon those that fear the Lord. Yep. Who went into that? Who, who the ones that feel the Lord? You Israelites, man. Right? You're the ones that actually feel the Lord and, and run away, especially the elect. All right? Go ahead. Verse 71. What? They shall be like madmen, sparing none, but still spoiling and destroying those that fear the Lord. Yeah, so these people... These troops, these guys that they're gonna have, all right, roaming these streets under the under the new world order, they're gonna be like madmen. The people up top of them are gonna be like madmen, sparing none. He don't wanna listen, he don't wanna confide. Like the dictator. Remember the movie The Dictator? They're gonna do this all the time. Just do this. Keisha over there hooping and hollering some old shit gonna do. Get rid of him, man. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna consent to the new world order. I'm not gonna get the chip. Kill him. And they're gonna do it so calmly, all right? Like the brother, the dream the brother uh, Kazak said. He said, "Man, <clears throat> he said the dream he had. He was at the, I believe he was at the concentration camp. He said the guy was doing so much killing inside the room. So when he came out the, he came out the room and looked down the hallway to see how many more people he had to kill, man. What a, what a sinister. He said the brother, he said the brother, he, he got so bad that his fucking face turned into a skull. <clears throat> that reminds me of a." Theme. Reminds me of a, a a scene from a gangster movie where uh, the hitman was saying, you know, did you know the first time I ever killed somebody, I threw up? But then the more times I did it, I just, I enjoy seeing the expressions on their face now. Yeah. yeah. And that's, that's how, you remember, who remember uh, Dead Presidents, which your boy uh, had the head and shit? That what happens over time. Especially when they eat anybody, when they eat anybody starts to, starts to get into that, nature that nature line of doing that type of where they get into it man they get their rocks off just to the hate to say this but the warm feel of, of, of the splatter of blood you know what i'm saying the smell of blood they get into that shit, man it's a, a blood orgy for them yeah. you know and then you know these devils already be dried up on the on the adrenochrome yeah. most either mice most either mice you see out here they're they on adrenochrome man you go find out what that is and where they get it from all right, <laughs> well, go ahead. You got a little more. I hope those that are members, but uh, for yeah. they sh go ahead. But they shall waste and take away their goods and cast them out of their houses. Yeah, take away your goods, all your possessions. All right, all the things that you uh hold dear to your heart, even your children. They're gonna take. They're gonna take your children. Scripture tell you, uh, it's another scripture in the pocket, but you don't have to get it. But it tells you about how children, children are gonna become ransomed. That's right. Hey, Joe. All right. Children are going to become ransom in that day. Something going on. Look. <clears throat> Verse 72. Every time you try to get out the way, you get in the way. Well, yeah, you, okay. Kind of, kind of. Uh, brother can get for me. Let's go 21. You can start at verse 9. 12. Is equal 21, 9 to 12. Just to back up what the brother's been going into, because this devil, hey, you got Jake in that party spirit right now. It's Bayou Classic. <clears throat> you know, Jake's looking to have fun. Little does Jake know that this Edomite behind the scenes is getting ready to make a sore slaughter of you Israelites out here. You know, we went into the history of 70 AD a couple of weeks ago on our uh, conference call. And what? That was the Edomites as the Romans coming against Jake to what? just destroy their land and sell them into slavery. Well, the Romans are coming back again to do the exact same thing. 
they're coming back to spoil Jerusalem again. And they're going to make the greatest slaughter because this is going to be the last slaughter before the kingdom of heaven. This is Ezekiel 21 and 9. It says, Son of man, prophesy and say, Thus said Yahweh, say, A sword, a sword is sharpened and also furbished. Keep going. It is sharpened to make a slow, a sore slaughter. <clears throat> it is furbished that it may glitter. Should we then make mirth? It contemned the rod of my son as every tree. So it's saying a sword is sharpened to make a sore slaughter. Should we then make mirth? Hey, Ecclesiastes chapter three, there's a time and a season for everything. And we're clearly not in a time of love and coming together and uh, eating popcorn. We're, we're on the verge of World War III, civil unrest, anarchy and chaos. So you should be in the spirit of making mirth. You should be in the spirit of getting closer to your power, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, because jujitsu, gun training, or uh, your uh, 401k isn't going to save you from the judgment that's about to come. Yeah, I remember there was a guy that came up, he was to be with the, with the apostles, his nigga, nigga name was Azar, he was all about him and me, I can break your neck, I can do this. That shit ain't gonna save you in that day, man. You know, when you know he starts scoffing at the apostles and shit, like on that, uh, on that, uh, minute, uh, what it is, mixed martial arts shit, that shit ain't gonna save you. Oh, yeah, right? It's, 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 it's that scripture in the, uh, I think Ecclesiastes. You know, it's not about strength. It's not about uh, 9 and 13. yeah, nine and thirteen. I think that is it. Hey, that shit ain't gonna save you, man. One thing you gonna you gonna need the Lord. Right. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn. You got three switches on top of one. On top of one switch, they ain't gonna be able to save you that day, man. I don't give a damn. You got the biggest, baddest motherfuckers. Right, they ain't gonna be able to save you. <clears throat> Niggas get smoked with the biggest shit on them every day. <laughs> oh, yeah. They done. They swore. Swore they ain't never stick. And we had that scoffer come out in the wheelchair, what, last weekend, talking about giving us some books to, you know, raise our credit scores. <laughs> we ain't in the time of raising a goddamn credit <laughs> score. Work. That All that <laughs> shit's about to collapse and go digital and bring the C here. Yeah, but, it, but it's, it's the same niggas doing that, but the, 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 the credit score, the, the scores has been raised up again. Seven percent for a car. Uh, uh, I think it's about same thing for a new house. Instead. So what this nigga talking about, man? All right. So nigga, you can't you can't trust a nigga with a catheter, man. The two broken, <laughs> two broken legs, man. He, he, he's pissing while he's talking to you. Driving a hell a Hellcat, <laughs> driving a fucking Hellcat. Uh, uh, wheelchair, <laughs> yeah, man. He pissed on. You. Yeah, you know, you yeah. Good. Pissed on me. Pissed on me. Fucking niggas. Ah, hell, kittens. Pissed on me. You got. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta chill, bro. Yeah, we get started. I, we just, I just hate them scoffers, man. Them niggas there, man. <clears throat> That's coming to an end too. You know what? Would you just have uh, TD Jakes have a have a stroke Go on ahead. the pulpit? And then uh uh yeah, the Lord smoked another nigga that was scoffing. Uh I'm a man. Oh yeah, yeah smoked that nigga, man. <laughs> I want everybody to pray for me. I got stomach cancer. Then he said, Oh, he 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 went into remission. Yeah, what happened? Lord, the next week the nigga died, man. You remember? That yeah. angel went in there and just busted his stomach. Hey, bust his stomach. <laughs> Why though? That nigga had a stomach on him too. Go ahead, brother. <laughs> Yeah, that. <laughs> 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 yeah, hey, like I said, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that John Wayne. If you know about uh, anybody know what happened to John Wayne? When John Wayne oh, died, yeah, John Wayne. No, John Wayne. Yeah, John Wayne. John Wayne. John Wayne died with twenty pounds of shit in his stomach, man. Look, look at that. I know he's a black hole. Look at that. Look at that. John Wayne. Well, well, topped out and bottled out. Well, 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 sometimes you can't have a bowel. Big time. You don't need no fiber. Yeah, yeah. No, none, man. You just eat pork chops and bourbon. Big J. Yeah, what do you think it's about? Big J. This nigga's screw out here, man. You know, the bourbon. Go ahead, I'll tell you. Verse 11. Oh, yeah. Verse 11. 
It says that he had given it to be furbished that it may be handled. This sword is sharpened and it is furbished to give it into the hand of the slayer. And we know who that slayer is. The sword of Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, is pursuant to Psalm 17, verse 13. The wicked Esau Edom. And, it, and the Lord is saying, look, that sword is going to be given to the slayer to make that sword slaughter. Hey, wrong about 20. Ooh, ooh, damn. Forty is <laughs> forty pounds of feet, man. Feet me in his stomach, man. Look at that. Yeah, man. I wouldn't be afraid of cowboy. Damn. The Lord probably kept him backed up so he could shit on himself and slay yeah. Hey, yeah. the dirt. <laughs> the dirt <laughs> came out. <laughs> 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 I was a thousand years of shit back there. That's a good test, brother. That's a that's a several hey, far way to go, man. Yeah. Nigga went out, nigga yeah. went out like Antiochus almost. <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, I think Vespasian, no, not uh, Ty, yeah, Vespasian, he died of colon cancer. Yeah, see, that's a lot of ways Edom must be going out of that stomach and colon cancer. And Lord be really jacking you, you eat myself, man. He give y'all skin cancer, all type of shit, you know, yeah. you know, because y'all, you know, y'all, y'all just filthy any goddamn way. Devil be into some shit, man. All right, that's why the same but what was crazy. You Jace, you Jace, a lot of things is starting to fall. The thing that will fall on the Edomites falling on you niggas, man. You dying in the same goddamn way. Horrible, horrendous deaths, man. Uh, you know? And though hand joined in hand, the wicked shall not go unpunished. Yeah. You want to live like the devil, you're gonna die like the devil. Yeah. yeah, that's why we don't feel bad for you niggas, man. Right? When we see something happen to the bulk of these Jays out here, that's judgment. It's the first thing we 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 uh we come. That's judgment, and the Lord judgment. You know? I'm gonna say that guy, uh, Chad with Joseph. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. And his stomach cancer too. Was yeah. Yeah. yeah, something to do with that. Hey, hey, he died right after he came out with that Wakanda shit, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Man, yeah. the Lord ain't with that, man. It's Israel. <laughs> 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 <That's> <laughs> a, no, that's, what's wrong with you? You had our people believing in that shit, man. Like, Jake thought Wakanda was, was a real place. place. Brother, that nigga a false prophet, brother. <laughs> Breaking that up, he was he was a false prophet. <laughs> Jake believed that, and the Lord like, really? Man, come up here with it. I got a good one for you. Uh, okay. Jeremiah 8 and 15, we look for peace, but no good came. And for a time of help and behold, trouble. Yeah, somebody got to get me Ezekiel, not Ezekiel, Isaiah 30, 1 to 3. And somebody in that Lamentations, uh, we look for our vain help. I think it's Lamentations yeah, 5, 5, 5, 4 and 17. 4 and 17. Repeat it again, I'm about to This Jeremiah 8, verse 15, we look for peace, but no good came. In a time of help and behold, trouble. And who's Jake mainly looking for peace and good times? America from Esau. Look at how much Jake was invested in these recent elections. Jake was really, Jake was really thinking that, look, whoever wins, hey, that's going to bring prosperous times back to America. And you got a lot of you simple you know, niggas and spicks out there that were saying blacks and Latinos for Trump. But hey, Trump... Trump again could very well be that cruel lord that's gonna bring down that hammer dead on you Jake's heads, and that's is what we hope for. Well, I had mentioned the word genocide, right? And genocide points out to a specific uh tribe. It says it says the rule that occupy Europe in reference to Nazi extermination of Jews, literally killing the tribe. So they they looking to kill what tribe? The twelve tribes of Israel. The real tribe. Yeah, the real tribe. You got it. With the Native Americans, that they called that a genocide because that's exactly what it God, was. It was a tribe. Um, that's why that's why they had. We went into independence. That's why they have uh, Native Americans in place for you. That's why they have other bills like Operation Cable Plot, Garden Plot, Operation Garden Plot, the ND, the National Defense Authorization Act. All right, mm -hmm. Project 2025 now. Project 2025, yep. and you have the Patriot Act one, two, and three. All those things with the established what? All right, to come up against. I was going to come up against you, Jake, because you got to understand when anything happens in society, you're a public enemy number one. Right, like, right. The lights can go out right now in this whole city. The first thing will come on in Edomite's mind. I got. I can't trust them niggas. I'm serious. 
<laughs> gotta get those things. Yeah. Hey, the right can do. I got I got burglar bars. Come on, different things on the house for what? Niggas. Niggas. Can't, <laughs> can't trust these <laughs> niggas, man. Yeah. All right, long since why, why you think the company ADT was was created? <laughs> for you jakes, man. All right. And you eat them that ain't right either. Also. All right, but the but public enemy number one is you. They come up against you. These bills are, are passed and signed for you, man. All right, because they know they, they got to deal with you first. Because when, when all else fails, you walls out, man. All right, and like, like in past videos, even the public said, man, you did not need the police, man. <clears throat> Imagine the police not in, in this society right here. Hey, this, a, a couple of brothers stay in a, in a, in a region of Louis, of New Orleans where the police, police ain't around. Yes. It's police. And yes. that bitch wild, man. You need, you need the expendables with you. Oh, that's rocking them. Yeah, rocking them. Yeah. You need all four and arms. Arms. You need all the niggas with you to go back there, man. All right, yeah. this, you can't that's stop. It, you can't stop at the gas station back there. You had to. You had to. You had to get gas. You know, this brother. He he lives past there. You had to get gas before that to pass through there to get to where you're going. Yeah. I don't want to stop there. Huh? I, I go all the way to North Shore Bayou. You got the interstate killer right there. Oh, yeah. too, man. Be smoking shit between that nigga every night, man. He's shooting shit from the building. He's still on the loose. <laughs> Serious shit. Hey. He's still on the loose. Hey, he's still on the loose, man. Hey, they, 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 hey, this brother here was messing so with it. My bad. This brother here was messing with a chick. The chick said, man, it's it's six serial killers in New Orleans. Active, active serial killers that uh control. Control, you know, was putting it on Jake to, you know, take the, you know, take the heat off of the Edomites that were doing it and try to not, and try to make it look like this city in just a war zone with a bunch of rampant psychopaths around. And you know, the brothers ain't lying because they had a video showing Edomites when they get uh like to Dalman or the high rise, they said it was doing 140 all the way through the east. <laughs> Yes. They say all of them. Like, how do you know about? Like, what what do they know that we don't know? You know, but Jake don't search and look around. There's there are articles where Edomites on a video saying, I, "When I get to Dalman, I'm doing 140 all the way to the, you know the the, the uh, yeah, stairs and everything." Yeah, you got it. It's hard to shoot a guy doing 140. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 Hard to you ain't got that much scope. Yes, bro. You ain't got that much scope to dope. You got to dope out the scope to try to even shoot some shit that that yeah, that's going that fast. Come on. You know. Too, man before it all you know all the lunatics are gonna come out man all of the closets all the skeletons and these guys that's lonely because let me say this too the one has got the most uh mental patients in all 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 the uh, other states man it's right here most mentally yeah. unstable when the brothers left he the brother go to work he work at one of them goddamn places we did you remember what that motherfucker name is who's one of them uh one of the batman characters what is it joker Joke, or Joke. Riddler? Nigga, Rid Riddler. Uh, Riddler. Yeah. yeah. Both of them. All of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Arkham Masson. Yeah. 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 Let me say this. My woman's aunt works at one of those places. He said, man, he said, these motherfuckers that work in the city hall, teachers, all type of shit, principals, all of them in that bitch, man. And, it, and he said, it is functioning out. Crazy motherfuckers. Beat their head against the concrete wall, all that shit. It's here. It is going to cut these. Hey man, MK Ultra, whatever they got, they gonna cut these motherfucking loose out here, man. God. You gonna have a real purge going, on, brother? You know? Go ahead. Huh? Go ahead. It's the Book of Revelation, chapter twelve, verse twelve. God. Therefore, God. rejoice, ye heavens, and he that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth yep. and the and the sea, for the devil has come down unto you having great wrath, because he knoweth that he hath but a short time. In Matthew 24 and 12 and get that word uh, uh iniquity and cold in it but as the brother just brought out the devil's about to come down in great wrath because he knoweth that he had but a short time and that devil is speaking about these Edomites which we know is the wicked who's going to be that slayer with the sword that's about to come down on you Jakes because these elites see the writing on the wall they see that Israel's waking up and these prophecies are coming to their fulfillment so they got a short time to bring about that NW0 so as it said, woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, 
Those that don't have that protective hedge of Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh shy over them because you're going to be completely assed out. And a lot of y'all have committed heinous, wicked crimes out here anyway. So when that judgment comes, it's going to come in like a flood and wash you away. That point you want yeah, to you want to say that the scripture, like the brother said, it goes into the elites, but these everyday Edomites, they notice the end too. Mm -hmm. They notice the end of their society. Some of them, they have enough money, they get bunkers and things like that. But the yeah, average knows. Yeah. Like, I found out a lot of these rich elites have panic rooms. Like the yeah. movie, I don't know if you brothers have seen the movie uh -huh. Panic Room. Uh -huh. They got that shit, man. Right? But they got uh, the house sealed off, so they, they go run in this room and got all these supplies and you know, they all sealed the fuck off. Yeah, you got that. Why why they call themselves preppers? What are they prepping them prepping for? They know what's coming. They know what's coming, man. And like I say, for you to be a fugitive and you didn't done everybody so wrong, I'll be spooking and paranoid too that my payback come, you know? That's it. Cause a lot of these a lot of these uh Bible Bible belt Christians in the South, a lot of the old Edomites always say, I hate the day to where when your people wake up my the delusion that they are. What they'll do, my people, all right? And we ain't that time. Look at that. Hey, there was one Edomite just to back you up that said, Hey, you Edomites that are living in the city, you're about to get slaughtered. See, you're gonna, you're gonna get slaughtered by these other, you know, you're speaking of Jake, yeah. about to get slaughtered by all these people that are people fucked over. <clears throat> just to back you up, everybody knows what it's hitting for except Jake. So, that's it. So that's why you're going to be caught unawares and completely asked out out here. And you know what? You deserve every ounce of it. Because for the last couple of decades, you've had the prophets out here preaching unto you, telling you of the times to come, but you treat us worse than you treat your own goddamn enemy. So fuck y'all. Yeah, they don't even know what their enemy is. 90% of Jake just voted for Kamala <laughs> Harris trying to bring everybody together, man. Fuck out. Yeah, because the motherfucker got some... And you can see a funny brown... That anyway, Matt Brown. <laughs> yeah, that was, uh, it is simple, man. You're Especially right. the black Eve, Eve, you gonna get you gonna get Molly out here, man. The bulk of you black women, you're gonna get Molly All right? And I'm gonna see what, what this independent feminine shit get you. All right, when these gladiators running around here on these streets, man. I don't need no man. Yeah, we're gonna see. Man ain't shit. Yeah, we're gonna see. Hey, you're starting to see a lot of not a lot, but a growing number of Eves take the social media being like, you know what? I, I do need a man. I specifically eat a black man. Because they know they know that these other men, you know, these other nations of men just use them. And they use them to give money. But the ones that actually cared about you, the your nation of own men, you treated them like less than shit. So you're going to get trodden down like less than shit. You think, if you think your little poom poom got power, man. Right? You think you think that holds the, the key to everything? Hey, hey man. As you can see, other men are other men are taking place to other places. You don't need you. You don't give a damn if you do go dry. I'm like, I can get it from somewhere else, man. You know, I go to I go to I go to Thailand, live like a king for six hundred, four hundred dollars a month, all right? And knock the stuffing out of something over there, man. A couple of things. All right? And they're gonna love me a long time. They don't give a damn, man. Yeah, BBC, BBC. You know? When Jake go other place, Jake get, Jake get dog called. They just want to say, they get called out. You know what I mean? You know, I used to do the cat call for a woman. They, the women do you that, man. Go, yeah. go your ass in Germany. Yeah, go to, go to uh, I think, uh, what that? Switzerland and shit. All them, all them European countries, them women love Jake. Philippines. Philippines, too. Central, uh, not Central America. Stay the fuck away from <laughs> South America. <laughs> <laughs> Don't go to Honduras, oh, yeah. Guatemala, San Salvador. <laughs> yeah, um, none of them. Yeah. But, yeah, uh, no, no, no. yeah. Got that Matthew 24. Yeah, God. Is, uh, these are the times we are coming into, and the brother's going to get some words in these verses, you know. That, that time where the devil's going to come down in great wrath, and as it says in Jeremiah 30, verse 7, as well as Daniel 12 and 1. You got it? Yeah. Con, con. Which one you got? Jeremiah. Jeremiah, hold that. We're going to get that Matthew first. Because uh, Matthew 24, verse 12. And because iniquity shall bound, the love of many shall wax cold. You got that word iniquity? Uh, this is that word iniquity. Uh, according to Blue Light, it says, the condition without law become ignorant of it, because of violating it, attempt, what the word ignorant means? 
it goes back to the word ignore to ignore the fact of they're gonna ignore the fact that these <laughs> the authorities law and order and all that shit, man they already do <laughs> they already do <laughs> Yeah, they say in that movie, uh, the Joker, man, he say, hey, with the children down, these civilized people, hey, they will eat each other. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hey, who, who, who coming up, who, what, what producer, or what guy coming up with those, with those quotes and sins? How did, that, that come, that has to come up from up top. Up top. Yeah. All right? That sounds like a, uh, a, 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 a Greek, Greek, Roman type of, uh, mindset. And, and they didn't know that. They didn't run tests on you people. All the chips fall. When, what happens when society... Doesn't have any bread and water. Don't have uh, lights. What happens with the people? What's the mindset of the people? They know. And because they, they really, they really have you people on a regimen. The food trucks come three, three days out of uh, out of the week, or so. Yeah. You know how many? No, back then we was coming in the truth. I think uh, one of the elites had spoke about. It. He say, he said that the, uh, he knew that the uh, the average, they analytical now. They run numbers in surveys. They, they said that they knew that I think the average uh, American home has only what uh, two days worth of food, and Jake only has about a day, <laughs> a day or so worth of food. Man. So How they know that? Twenty-four hours and forty-eight hours. It's over. With. And you know, they they literally call you know the delivery system the just-in-time delivery system because immediately when a store runs out of a product, that's when the trucks just in time bring it in it. and we saw what happened during uh the c19 and things were starting to brew with that uh that dock workers strike so when they really pull the trigger on things hey it's gonna go just like that quick too got a quick too your, your local stores gonna get bum rush hey man you know how many people stay just in your area that's gonna bum rush these walmarts and shit <laughs> First day. First day, it's gonna burn right. It's gonna look like it's gonna look like a damn tornado went went through it, man. I think we can see and Walgreens. Yeah, yeah. Drugs, yeah. Medicine. Yeah. Cause these, them, we we didn't say it in the past. I remember his brother talked about it on the past lesson. All these all these people that's gonna go and went to go into withdrawal. These druggies. Mm -hmm. Out here, these people that's on insulin. That shit gonna go fast, man. Fast. I'm talking about real fast. Some people, are, you know, people dog is true, so they're gonna just take shit. They don't even need this shit. They're yeah. gonna take it so they can resell it. They do that for the hurricanes. They take all the water. You know, they go in there, and take all the bread and the water. By the time you get there, you get off work. Ain't nothing. Ain't nothing. This has been two hours. You know, like you know, it should be retarded. Only thing left is some goddamn potato. Yeah. Like, <laughs> <laughs> <that. matter>. <laughs> you, you, you be like, I don't know. Yeah. You know, in a in a can of peas. And then cream of corn. That's all the thing left, man. A, a dinner yeah. can of pain, peas. <laughs> you gonna feel it though. You old folks, all right? You 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 older people here. First to go. You gonna be the first to die. The first to go, like the yeah. birthday. The first to go. Dialysis. Yeah. They ain't gonna be no doctors. They ain't gonna be no. They ain't gonna, the hospitals only gonna get blood rush, man. Yeah. The sick, the people that's injured, they gonna get over over overcrowded, man. And then, like I say. In the time of Katrina, they went into Dr. Kevorkian uh mode, man. They were just offing people. In the in the hospitals down here off uh Car no, no, on Napoleon. Yeah, Jeff Davis too. Yeah, they were yeah, killing people. They was killing people. <laughs> no, I'm yeah. Just pulling the plug a machine, whatever yeah. they on when they on some time. And they said they were giving them that giving them the giving them the shot, man. Yep. Go ahead, Doc. Ain't nothing we can do for them. Yeah. Cause once th that's another thing. We've been hearing talks about cyber attacks and EMPs. And everything, this whole society is just completely reliant on the electrical grid. Yeah, yeah. And they say that too. Oh uh, yeah, it's weak. Cause we seen this, yeah. the hurricane this bad. Uh, Ida. No, it was another one. No, Ida was the one. No, what's the one that was when the, when the tower collapsed? The, that was Ida. Oh, Ida. Oh. What happened? The, the damn power was out. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. They friend And they said these experts said two things that if. If the American grid were to go down overnight, we would go back to conditions of the 1860s. Overnight. And within the first, I think he said within the first three to three to six months of a, a complete grid down situation, 93% of the American population would be dead. Yeah. That's it. They showed that in that movie, uh, 333 that you yeah. put in there on. Yeah. 333, yeah. It's 333 under, I mean, 
It was 333, the EMP. EMP. Yeah. Like EMP 333 days. But the first couple of days, it, you weren't hearing nothing. They you start hearing, ah, scream and shoot. <laughs> and everything. Doors getting kicked doors in. Doors kicked in. It just. Man, it's all that shit you got. You get, body you got. Oh, God, I got the, I got the, I got the red dots code. When the EMP hit, that shit ain't going to burn. Cars. Cars, none of that shit work. Unless you got, unless you have a, a safe. You got something that has that that blocks out the uh, the EMP a Faraday cage, Faraday cage and shit, man. All right. Other than that, you are gonna go back to the Stone Age overnight, literally. Yeah. You people that got even in that movie, they showed a guy had a uh, he had that fake heart, the pacemaker, the, the mom, the, the, the grandma, the yeah. girl grandma, yeah, it dropped yeah. dead. She dropped yeah. dead. Soon as it, soon as the EMP hit and the lights went off, I think she died like two days later. What happens to the, like a day or so later? Like we got planes and shit flying over us. What happens to the planes and the helicopters? They got fall down here. Show that it leave the world behind. Yep, yeah, yeah. Just leave the world behind. Yeah. I was gonna, I was gonna say they had a famous uh podcast where he got he said what uh how devastating the EMP yeah, yeah. was to the nation. Um, he said it's one of the most devastating things ever. He said you're not thinking. He said hundreds of thousands of people will die within the first twenty minutes because all the planes will fall. You know, and that would shake the core of the nation immediately. You know, and not just the people in the planes, but the people on the ground. Yep. Those yeah. planes crash. Yeah, that's them. Yeah, people you got the hospitals. Got a domino effect, man. Yeah. yeah. That was that movie, though. Uh, Leave the world behind. That was that movie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you had some. Yeah, we're just going to finish out yeah, in that Matthew 24 and 12. But as I said, because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall wax cold. And if the grid were to go down, a society would collapse. That would be iniquity or lawlessness instantly. And one of the other definitions in there says people are in contempt of the law, yeah. meaning they scoff and despise at it. So everybody's going to get it how they live. You know, Gerald Salente had that famous saying, when people got nothing left to lose, yeah. they lose it. Yes, yeah. Of course, I actually stand in the eye. Con. Get that word cold. Uh, it's that word cold according to a bullet. Uh, it's a metaphor, metaphor of waning love. And what does it mean? What is it in the Hebrew? I mean, yeah. the Greek. Psycho. Oh, yeah. Psycho. That word cold in the That's Greek is psycho. psycho. And a psychopath is somebody that they, they look at other people as just an object. Like, it's just, I'm fulfilling my own lusts and emotions. Yeah, we're going to take the word rainy in that definition. It means uh, to disappear, decrease. Rainy. Yeah. 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 So it's going to be a psychotic, cold, destructive energy out here. And a lot of you Israelites are going to be dead in the middle of it. Like zombie effect. Lulu is going to be uh, let loose, man. The freaks are going to come out at night. Right? What you think going to happen in these psych, in these psych wars in these prisons? No people going to get out of there, man. All right, they'll be they having for Katrina. When hey, when you heard about Katrina, the next morning woke up, everything was all right, all cool until they showed the, the prisoners down here on the bridges lined up by the police. And you seen them running away. Then all of a sudden, the old lady heard about the you heard about the, <laughs> all the grape picking going on, man. Yep. You heard about all the all the all the, 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 the grapes being being uh crushed on, man. Getting all right? the juice. And then, like I said, from there you just see you you heard and you you see wild shit going on, man. And they know that Katrina was a Katrina was a test run mm -hmm. to see what they're gonna do, All right? And they can do that. They can do a Katrina anytime now. Man, that'd be a wild JT. There's the water down here, high as a motherfucker. You waste even yeah. water, ain't it? Got alligators and shit. Man, they got they got some shit, boy. You got some, you got some shit to deal with. Yeah, In Jeremiah 15. What does it say? Oh, Keep the wild. Kind of, kind of, that's the spirit. Oh, yeah. That's the water. <laughs> it is cold, like the Lord says, pray, 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 not to die. Uh, it's like being in the winter. winter. You got to deal with that. It's be cold, bro. <laughs> it's kind of, <laughs> that's what I'm saying, too. I mean, that's why they sit down. It is hard running in the cold because you lose oxygen fast, man. All your, all your survival gets thick. Joints, man. Yeah, man. You don't want to get too sweaty because then you, then you start really... Getting cold and shit is a lot to deal with, man. You kindle a fire. You could signal to other people your location. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, because you can't do that. Like right now, it was JT. We we can't even have that goddamn light on, man. This light let people know where we at miles and miles away. All right. 
Myself. And I remember during one hurricane, it was was when I was in high school, you know, all the lights were out. All you had was the stars in the sky. And I was driving back to my parents' house. Yes. And I'm saying, mm -hmm. I literally could not see what was in front of me. Right. Like, I could just see the outline when I got close to it. So imagine you being in a situation where it just that type of pitch black Ooh. and no food, no hope, no nothing. I could, I could say from experience and uh doing katrina when we was in there there was no lights like when they got dark like this you saw nothing nothing it's just like uh that uh is that wisdom of solomon when they say the air uh, wisdom of felt solomon. like shit passing by you people and people was packed up but if somebody walked past you man you don't know what that is bro and it was pitch black no lights there was no lights so when it got dark it was dark, dark. Mm. it was dark dark you know so imagine all the fatalities and different things that they didn't report man mm -hmm. you know and it was like that almost a full seven days it was actually like the seven i was down in six days and then when it get night you had to go stand by your family and pray to god and you know most people don't know know the lord you know yeah, yeah. it ain't gonna take many years because yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's, it's at night too man yeah mm -hmm. you move at night you definitely don't want to be caught with your pants around your ankles. God. You said in that day, uh, I always say you say that they had the night vision goggles. You know, yeah. they, that's what they was doing, Jake, though. Yeah, I heard about right. that. It was so dark. Yes. In the Iverville project, that, Jake would be shooting at the, shoot, them down. Shooting at the uh, helicopters and shit like that. Going them down. But they said them, them, them different uh, IDF troops they had over here and uh, Blackwater troops, they'll put the night vision goggles on. Teddy Ellis. At nighttime, then you wake up in the morning, dudes was dead, hanging out the window, all in the hallway, dead, slumped over. They are just running through shit. No. What was it called? The Green Eyes? Was it? At the, That's the racket called them the yeah. Green Eyes. Yeah. Yeah. Because of, the, cause of the, the night vision, the IR lasers they got. Because when you put, when you have IR lasers on, infrared lasers, you put that shit on, it'd be daytime. It, when you look through it, it's daytime out here. You can see everything, everything moving. <clears throat> And like I said, this devil don't fight for it. He's gonna have that shit on in that day. Mm -hmm. Thermal scopes, all that shit. You can't put on a thermal scope, you can be way back there hiding on the ground. He can see you. Your body heat. He's so <laughs> yeah. see your head just peeking over and then lights out. <laughs> you see a flash. The white light. He devil he devil coming. He devil coming with suppressors and all type of shit, man. You know? Like I say, it's like we 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 right over here, them. Five, seven, seven hundred thousand dollar, million dollar uh, condos. They, they got them in there. They got the person in there. Yeah, let me my, let me my, let me my, locked and loaded, ready, ready for Jake, man. Yeah, so, we, all we know, they could be looking through the scope at us right now. Yeah. Just yeah, oh, yeah. Ready, man. Watch that, man. You got, you got, you got these, uh, you got these certain guys in these, in these groups. Yeah. These uh, white supremacist groups. They looking for that day to get down. Yeah, yeah. You're looking for that. They've been they've been hoping for that day, man. Training. You know, training for it. Yeah. And then we have. I was gonna say that the militias are ready for the uh, big immigration mm -hmm. thing. Yeah. That's what they uh, they waiting on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They said they, they put aside our issues with the government mm -hmm. just to deal with these immigrants, meaning deal with you sticks. That's what yeah. they're saying. Yeah, you 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 are Northern Kingdom. What are you? What are you? An Asian? Spin a cell or not, you know. <clears throat> you, you damn Hamites, all of you, you got Russians over here now. Ukrainians, Iranian, Iranians, all type of shit over here. Turks, Chinese, they, they ain't over here. A lot of them, a lot of them military, man. Oh, yeah. This they had, they had, had a guy in, in the Denver uh, airport. He showed, he showed his phone. Yeah, I was in the, I was in the uh, Venezuelan army. This motherfucker had an LMG. This goddamn long, man. Touching the ground. Why is he here? He didn't get it on with you, Jakes. And you really, you Americans, man. At the mall, some festival. They can hit, they can hit at any place now. That's why I said the Super Bowl. You know, who knows what, you know, and hey, man, the Lord want to do something cool. Super Bowl, what else they got coming out here? Body Graf. I have a goddamn parade for every damn thing. Mm -hmm. You know, a second line because Trump won the elections. It's crazy, man. <laughs> yeah, you niggas, you niggas in the water is simple, man. 
All right, that's why I, said, I can't wait to the Lord. I'm talking about the Lord just cut loose on you, Jake's out here. You simple nigga. Every Sunday, you niggas having a uh, 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 damn second line going on, man. Blocking up Washington and places. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All that goddamn barbecue. Nigga, second line, why he just eating the chicken bones, spinning and shit. He's <laughs> 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 eating this shit. Y'all niggas be out here. Y'all look half the head, man. You go. I'm serious. I got you on yeah, niggas, niggas gone out here, man. Sure. What does it say the city that care forgot about, man? Go ahead. This is Michael 5 and 7. It says, And the remnant of Jacob shall be in the midst of many people, oh. as a dew from Yahweh, as the showers upon the grass that tarry not for man, nor waited for the sons of men. And the remnant of Jacob shall be among the Gentiles in the midst of many people, as a lion among the beasts of the forest, as a young lion among the flocks of the sheep, who, if he go through, both tread it down and tear in pieces, and none can deliver. Mm. So he gonna be, like the brother said, you Israelites, all right, so you so-called Negro, Latinos, and Native Americans, y'all gonna be in the midst of many people, and y'all gotta fight, man. Yeah, That's part of y'all judgment. Two thirds of y'all gonna get cut off and die, somebody pestilence and a famine, but most of y'all gonna die in, in, in these, these little proxy wars, these little, these, these little skirmishes, uh, Salaki, these skirmishes and different things like that. It says the remnant of Jacob. Y'all gonna be in that, man. Yeah, Jacob Trouble, man. That's for two thirds, man. Yeah, brother. That's All right. right. 14 and 2. They ain't they ain't out, they ain't out of water go out here and, and trying to get in the mix of that shit. That shit gonna be for y'all, man. Among the Gentiles in the midst of many people as a line. That's why I say Judah's a cross down line. Who shall rise him up? Yes. You're gonna have to fight. And then Jake, you're gonna die. They like to fight anyways. Don't two thirds our people like to fight. I'm about to pull up, I'm gonna sling that iron. What you gonna do is the day to sling that iron. That's what Jay gonna do in that day, man. That's the fans, man. That's, that's him, that's white people. That's them people. Niggas gonna tuck tail. And they're gonna tuck tail, man. We know, we know you niggas, bro. You got it, huh? God. I know y'all. I still got the job. Give me that. Give me that Zechariah fourteen and two. Give me that Jeremiah. And I'm just gonna say real quick in, in that movie Fight Club, they said, and in the third and final rule of Fight Club, if it's your first night, you have to fight. You gotta. You have to fight. So Jake, That's you gonna you gonna have to fight. There's a problem. There's gonna be no exactly. There's gonna be no sitting sitting waiting for nine one one. You're gonna have to fight to the death. And you are gonna die. Yeah, you can't turn your head from blood, man. Blood, yeah. blood's coming. Yeah. All you, all you, uh, uh, metrosexual, all you metrosexual brunch eating niggas, yeah, they thug got niggas, man, thug magnificent niggas, you gonna have to fight, man. Right? All you bitch ditty boys. Right. Ain't no way of getting around it. You gonna have to get it on with these eating mics. You got to get it on. And transformers gonna be out there. Yeah. Get your high heels off. Get ready. Yeah. <clears throat> And they ain't just gonna be raping women, they're gonna be raping men too. Yeah, yeah we the 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 remnant that one third of the you know that the elect of the Lord, I don't want about the sign we those men. Isaiah 33 and 6 is what we're gonna be looking for exemption. Mm -hmm. The wow, it says uh what a, that's a, uh Proverbs 22 and 3, approved man for said the evil and hide himself. But you got Jake's out your want to sling that now. I'm stepping, they all on the internet, everywhere, like they got it out, it's on me. All right, everywhere you go, well, all right. That's that's that. Remember, that's your enemy. They're the the, the sword is their blessing. Yeah. So get get ready, man. That's and then what's making matters worse. We in the uh, we in a, we in a state or the city. They they deem what sportsman's paradise. It's paradise. So most of these hunters that hunt hunt all these fucking uh elk and deer and shit. Who you gotta come up and get? You gotta go get them niggas. Game right? on. Yeah. And that's how they looking at it. It's gaming. Yeah. What do you call that gaming, right? Yeah, yeah. They call it the game. Yeah. Big yeah. game. Big game. Big game. What? Yeah. And most of you niggas, you you can't shoot a piece of paper right in front of your goddamn face, man. Yeah, man. You ready to find? You got no, you shot. got no red dots. You got niggas got no iron sights, no scopes, nothing. And you know what the hell you doing? Hell no, I can't. Like my grandpa said, he's my grandpa was telling me right now for this guy. I seen a nigga shoot a nigga. He said, man, I laughed my ass off, and he did just what you said. I said, what he did, grandpa? Right on, I'm on. <laughs> <Nigga, look. laughs> The gun is, the gun is busting off, man. That's what two niggas do. 
All you niggas shoot like you in uh, World War. You ever play uh, Battlefield One? Yes, bro. Nigga be up there. Nigga be like that. Feet like this. <laughs> All you niggas shoot, man. Jig no, that's not your blessing. You, you got jigs who into that shit that can get down, but the bulk of you, Jake, you, you niggas need to drop the guns, man. Yeah, How about you niggas scared? You niggas can't fight. You can't shoot. You can't do nothing. <laughs> can't rap. You can't, niggas can't do nothing, man. You just you need to just put it down. Good for nothing. These, these devils, these devils know what they're doing. I'm talking about the the, the little the little kids of these right. devils know what they're doing. They got the money to do, do know what they're doing and train for the world. Yeah, the scripture tell you in uh, Genesis the 25th chapter, Esau was a cunning hunter, man. There you go. And you going into that word cunning, hey, he was very to be a hunter, you have to be uh what's the word? Keen, patient. You gotta be keen, patient. You gotta be a person that's kind of like search, like a serpent. You gotta blend in, you gotta put on camouflage. Sometimes you see you see Edom like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, you think it'd be all in the tree, man. Well, deer pits on them. You know, yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah, hunting right now. Yeah, so that same devil is gonna do that with, with you, Jake, man. Yeah, Jake the Jake the cattle that's just eating the grass, you know, just eating the grass while he hunting them. You know, he got yeah. the aim on him. And everything, and Jake just eating the grass, and he just raising his head up, and the next thing you know, wow. he on this wall. He a, he a, a trophy so, on this wall, man. Hey, what that scripture, <laughs> that scripture in, uh, it's in the Psalms, you don't have to get it, but it tell you that he, he uh, he's like a lion that cast out, cast out a net. Yeah. He does catch the pork, or something like that. Yeah, that's a, it's Psalms 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. Like you can get it, get it, get it. When he, uh, when he, when he casts his net. This devil has many nets, many traps that he tries to trap Jake with, man. He he trap a lot of you niggas. You niggas fall for it. Back then, it, I think yeah. down here they were having that show. Uh, y'all ever seen that show they did down here? Trapsters? Yeah. Yeah, when they had the car door open, oh my nigga walk Eight by. Cuffs. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Get in the yeah, car. Yeah. Yeah, I was just, wait, yeah. <laughs> 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 Stupid ass. Yeah, yeah, kind of. It was. It wasn't called that. You talking it's about bait car? Bait car. It was called bait car. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Could be the dumbest nigga ever to fall for that. <laughs> well, Jake is <laughs> experts. Hey, Jake is experts in stupidity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> the experts in stupidity, bro. Side is chill. Side is Yeah. Hold on, you see that? Hold on, hold on. Look, look, look around. Get you. <laughs> That's what it was called. Bait call collide. Going down look. I used to watch that. Nigga be trying to come. Man, son, I hope, I hope this bitch ain't one of them cars. Get in there. Been turned off. He trying to turn the corner. Been turned off. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Yeah. You niggas is stupid, man. Yeah, but that's the part of trap, huh? Then he tried to lie about what yeah. he was in the car. Yeah, he yeah. done my man's car bringing it back to him. <laughs> <laughs> niggas stupid, man. Why you niggas gonna get caught up like that? He's still gonna put out some like, trap, put out some fruit or some shit, and kill you niggas, man. But you don't, Expert. hey, man. You niggas, you niggas is just, like the trip just said, you just silent, man. Go mm -hmm. ahead. This is, uh, yeah, this is uh, we'll start, uh Mercy. This is Psalms ten and eight. It says he sit up in the lurking places of the villages. As a hunter, uh, uh, what a hunter do? He sit in the lurking places. That's it. So, this nigga might, hey man, this nigga he's so cold with it. He puts on a ghillie suit. Yeah. All that grass, <laughs> shit. He lays on the ground. They got videos on YouTube. Go, go look up uh hiding, uh, hiding in camouflage. This nigga be way looking at you against the trees. Who that? Who who thinks like that? A cunning hunter, and the and the Lord made him that way. He's hardwired that way to be uh like that, man. That's a term Jake used down here. Kalaya, I'm brothers familiar with what Jake said. I'm lurking. Yeah. Yeah. Jake say that, like you know. So the the, the yeah. scriptures don't lie. But you're not lurking like either. You ain't lurking like either. He be in the tree, yeah, <laughs> in them stands. Yeah, he in the heavens. Watch. Do you ever? You I know you. You know he be into some shit like this. You ever seen them video with them Navy SEAL niggas? Them niggas be on the water, come up slow. The water with be no raining. bubbles. With no bubbles. <laughs> nigga, look at that shooting shit. <laughs> already aimed in. Yeah, yeah. They just aimed in already. You're looking at a bush or a tree and then a bunch of guys yeah, come out of it. Out that bitch, man. That's some scary shit there. Yeah. Uh, as a riot. Hey, brother, you, you commented on it. You put the heart. You saw that? I put a video in there that uh, show. Like the, the secret servicemen for the FBI. Yeah, they got fake hands that's out. 
and all they shit on their grips, like in the inside of the, the whole outside, it's like a, um, yeah. it's still, like so a break room, room pull so that thing out. They got all of, they, they hands, Trust. like you, you sit on some time with their hands right here. Yeah. It's fake arms and hands, and they under there with the, to pull a big shit off. So when they go down, <laughs> I'm ready. I saw that. I'm like, God damn. Woo. You know, they had their hands a certain way with Jeff Bezos, his bodyguard. Oh, I, I did they, see they, like, they, uh -huh. they, Sometimes you'll see them with they kind of like, you know, walking yeah. as they're looking around. That's all fake right there. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you call it? Facade. Like, it's just a facade. And they actually underneath that with their hands that? already on a big artillery so they could just break out and get busy. Say we're a big jacket on. Big so they jacket got the shit, so they got the shit underneath holding it, man. Oh, yeah, man. Damn. That's what you. That's what you up against, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> they think it though. They the order, like you said, they yeah. thinking, but it's a thinking game. Yeah, it's a, that's a mind of a killer. Uh, Esau is a real killer, killer man. Yeah. Real gangster. You niggas play. You niggas be playing games. Hey, yeah, you niggas play games. Like the brother said, Lark. You gotta look into what Lark means. Live action role play. You <laughs> niggas playing games. This nigga is a real gangster. This nigga that took over continents, land, uh, city states. Countries, man. Yes, he stole the, the world. world. Hey, he stole the whole that? Western hey. Hey. <laughs> God brothers need to go find out what happened to Czar Nicholas II. All right, and show me and tell me how they killed him and his family and his children. And tell me that was some gangster shit. <clears throat> That's how them devils came into power. That's like he was the last <clears throat> thing. Czar Nicholas II was like the last guy that held the world power back then. Did he? They they killed him. He is like the last true monarch. That war was the uh the, it was a Russian Civil War. It's called it was called some the start of beat. The Bolshevik, Bolshevik Revolution. Revolution. The Bolshevik Revolution, man. Them fucking needs had something to do with that. You know, like I said, I think that dude, uh Zar Nicholas II, I think he was a like a light skinned Jake. Hey, okay. I think he was a Jake though, man. Lenin, Trotsky, Stalin, who were the heads of the Bolshevik Revolution, they were all Amalekites. Yeah. And then one of that last bit of he held that last bit of power. <laughs> He was, he was in their way, just like the guy that was on the Titanic. Jacob Aston. Jacob Aston. He was the last guy in their way that, that wouldn't want to give him that power. So they took him out. And then a year later, they said, well, I believe they set up the IMF the year later, man. The Federal Reserve. The Federal Reserve, slightly. Like, yeah, the Federal Reserve the year later. Jekyll Island. On Jekyll Island, man. That's some gangster shit. Hey, JFK. Some gangster shit. Wanted to put the dollar back on the silver standard. Oh, go we got some silver for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, what's the other guy? Because really, I'm gonna say this: Abraham Lincoln and John F. Kennedy was the same person, man. Forty years later, assassination, guy. Like, uh, hey, somebody uh, funny. JFK was killed by Lincoln. You know, you can get yeah. Abraham yeah. Lincoln was killed in the Ford Theater. Yeah. you tell me that ain't no, there ain't no coincidence, man. A reincarnation, incarnation, come on. All right, it just what we're talking about. This devil here, he, he, he's the seed of Esau. So whatever Esau was into it and did back then, they're the same way. They, hey. they walk outside right now, all that, you know, you know, you know, people in the world said, y'all ever heard the grandma and Oman said, man, white people got lizard skin. They, you know, they come outside barefooted, it's cold as fuck right now. School, man. Yeah, so they don't want to come outside like that, barefooted, rain, snow. Yeah, you know, they don't matter, man. You know, it don't matter with them. Hey, that Romans 8 goes both yeah. up, both ways. The spirit beareth witness that we're the children of God. The spirit bear witness that they're the Edomites. Yeah. The children of the God. wicked. Uh, you got it. You got it? Yeah, bring it up. Okay. And sort of, and sort of, and sort of, and sort of, sort of what you read, because we, we ain't just making nothing up, man. We ain't, we ain't just making nothing up. 13 coincidences between JFK and Lincoln says Lincoln was elected to Congress in 1846. Kennedy was elected to Congress in 1946. Uh, Lincoln was elected president in 1860. But that's a hundred years later. Yeah. Which shows it could be two to three generations. You know, yeah, yeah. It even shows that. Or it could be the next, whatever the law was. Yeah. Yeah, you got it. Kennedy was elected in 1960. Hundred years later. Hundred years later. Lincoln, his wife lost a child while living in the White House. Kennedy lost his wife lost a child while living in the White House. Mm -hmm. Lincoln, he was directly concerned with civil rights. Kennedy was directly concerned with civil rights, so-called helping Jake. All right. Lincoln had a secretary named Kennedy who told him not to go to the theater, number one. Kennedy had a secretary named Lincoln who told him not to go to Dallas. <laughs> Dang. They were both assassinated. Yeah. It says Lincoln was shot in the back of the head in the presence of his wife, 
Kennedy was shot in the back of the head in the presence of his wife. Lincoln shot in the Ford Theater. Kennedy was shot in a Lincoln made Man, by Ford. They were both shot on Damn. Friday. Uh, the assassin John Wilkes Booth was known by three names comprised of 15 letters. The assassin Lee Harvey Oswald was known by three names comprised of 15 letters. And I okay. believe John Wilkes Booth was a Mason. And, you know, Lee Harvey Oswald, if you look at some of the images when he was getting arrested, he was making them hand signs. Yeah, they which, all, which him, all those guys, even the guy that, even the guy that shot and killed, uh, look, I looked him up no. some years back. No, uh, the, the big mouth, the big mouth, uh, 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 here if you look. That guy they like, shot here if you look at the at the uh, state capitol, he was a gutter rat too, working for the elites, man. Go ahead. So his John Wilkes Booth was killed before it being brought to trial. Oswald was killed before being brought to trial. Come on now. It says there were theories that Booth was part of a greater conspiracy. There were theories that <laughs> Oswald was part of a greater conspiracy. It says Lincoln's successor was Andrew Jackson, born in 1808. Andrew Johnson. Andrew Johnson, kind. So like Kennedy's successor was Lyndon Johnson, born in 1908. 100 years old. Come on, man. <laughs> and then, like I see, both of them, both of them also had uh, work with two Jakes. Damn, this is one with the two Jakes. It's like uh, they had, they were working with two uh, civil rights Jakes. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Kennedy worked with uh, Martin Luther King and what was it, Franklin? Was it, was it Frank Douglas? Douglas. Frank Douglas. 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 Yeah, it's a bunch of other similarities. They they both uh like the elder one and earlier, they were both trying to take uh power from the bankers, man. That's why they got assassinated. Yeah, openly talking shit against the bankers. Yeah. All right, uh, changing the, the the silver back. All right, having it back, having it back by uh having it back by something, man. Metal, yeah. And metal. And they won for that. All right. You know the truth, there's no such thing as coincidence. That's, a, exactly. that's clearly they were the same person. That's like saying love. Yeah. You know, the Lord don't deal with love. We don't deal with coincidence. Yeah. Everything is incident. Whatever happened, it's incident. In Beef of Vendetta, the, the main character told this one character, there are no coincidences, just the illusion of coincidence. Yeah, that's <laughs> a video. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to that, brother. They both, they both so-called try to help Jake, but what happened immediately after Shadow Slavery? You had the 13th Amendment, they just started locking up Jake's Jim Crow. Sure was supposed to get better, but it really got worse. Yeah. And the same thing happened in the Civil Rights Movement. I was supposed to help Jake and just yeah. destroyed our family, man, our businesses, our communities. So things just got worse, man. You know, the only reason why one reason why they they let let off you niggas a little bit because they found they can make money off you baseball in, in, in integrating you into baseball to what to make money singing all that Motown shit mm -hmm. it made money off that shit man mm -hmm. all right even going to the gangster rap gangster rap was started by uh about about gutter rats man all right Jerry Heller Jerry Heller and them man them, them gutter rats man. you know. It's all about the shekels, man. No matter how you want to put it, it's all about the shekels. It's all about, about this in the interest. That was gonna give two two shits about you, man. I'm about to say what. What you doing, buddy? They made our, our life of. Uh, I got it. Pastime. I got it. Oh, kind of Solomon 15 and 12. But they counted our life of pastime. Because they tell you, and also so Rocky, the Alberta know where it's at. He says, uh, that they uh they use D for what they need to use you for. That's thirteen. That's thirteen. 13 yeah. It says, yeah, yeah, yeah. but they counted our life a pastime and our time here a market for gain. And a pastime is something you do for fun. Right. So they treat Jake's life is a game to them out here. Yeah. A game for gain. Useless too. Mm -hmm. It's not a pass. They don't have nothing to do with going forward, man. You know, and that's behind. Brother, gonna bring out that Sirac. Well, once they once they got everything they could out of you, they just toss you to the side and get the next J. Yep. For say day, we must be getting every way, though it be by evil means. And it says, uh, in the wisdom of Solomon too, that let's not let a a, a a flower of the uh of our day pass us by. Flower of our youth pass. Yeah. So that in their voluptuousness. <laughs> Which let us abuse. Let us abuse. Yeah, man. Let us let us do whatever it is necessary to them while we here. Cause when we do go, there's no we don't got no more use for nothing. So they're gonna use, they gonna they say let us speedily use the creature as in the days of our youth. You know? 
Let let no day in a, it says let no day in a hour of Salah. You get it? It's wisdom of Solomon too. Let no day uh actually pass us by or so. I paraphrase it, but they don't they using Jake just to <clears throat> by any means, man. So listen, it's all about yes, listen. listen. Yeah. So you know, it is taking advantage of Jake, man. There you go. Every token. <clears throat> you got that uh mm -hmm. yeah, go ahead. Yeah, this uh, the book of Sirach, chapter 13, and verse 5, and it reads... Your brother left the other light? No, I think he took it with him. Okay, don't worry about it. If thou have anything... Start at full. It reads, if thou be for his prophet, he will use thee. But if thou have nothing, he will forsake thee. If thou have anything, he will live with thee. Mm -hmm. Yea, he will make thee better and will not be sorry for it. If he have, if he have, like say it, you know, but, look at, look at Diddy right now. No. They used him for all they could. And now, you know, they're dropping the hammer on him. And that's with every single one of these Jakes out here. I, re I remember it was with the, I think the, one of them Jake singers from back during the Motown days, he had a gutter rat as his manager. And then the you gutter, talking about, you talking about, uh, it's Jackie. I don't know who you're talking about. Jackie's, Jackie Wilson. It might be Jackie Wilson. He had a gutter rat as, as his manager. The gutter rat was getting all the money. What did they do with Muddy Waters? Dude, Muddy Waters. Man. And then when Jackie Wilson died, if it is Jackie Wilson, when he right. died, they I said they, that gutter rat credited all the songs Jackie Wilson wrote and sang to his son, to the gutter rat's son, that he was the one that wrote wrote those songs for him. Look at all the gladiators of today, all the dudes that play sports. They legs and knees all broken up. They don't give them no yeah. assistance, no, you know, no insurance and shit. What you born at? Uh, Julius Rose, Dylan Rose, J J J no, uh, Derek Rose. Derek Rose. No, Dylan Rose, the bad ass. Oh, Jalen Rose. <laughs> you, know, with, uh, you know what I'm talking about? With uh. Well, Michigan, Chris Webber. Yeah, yeah he be up there. Yeah. Yeah. Kenny, no, Kenny Smith. Yeah, that nigga. Kenny Smith. You see that? You see that? Yeah, from the Rockets. Yeah, from the Rockets, Kenny Smith. Yeah, this shit, man. That, that niggas got CTE. They are not even giving them. They fighting for the get uh Then when they do get uh met, uh, the, the insurance, people like Big Baby Davis, they they steal all the shit and be all in uh, out of town yeah, on vacation good. and shit. You know, for their dental plans and different. They don't even give them that. You gotta be a, make a certain amount of years as playing in sports just to receive some insurance. But most of them people have abused and beat their bodies up, man. Right. Some of them, most of them can't walk. You know, that's why you don't hear from them. Brain damage. They brain damage, you know, embarrassing, taking all these hits and shit. They ain't doing you nothing for you. Yep. Yep. Them niggas on painkillers. All kind of shit, man. Show up, man. Yeah, bro. Hey, they had a major controversy a couple of years ago with uh, Jake, ex-former football players, trying to get the money. Yeah. Because what the courts were saying is like, look, we will give the money to the white football players because the black football players weren't that smart to begin with. So they really didn't lose too much intelligence. But that's real life I, shit. Like that's, that's what, that's what we, you know, that's the energy. So the Edomite football players get all the money because they're saying, look, they had them. They had more to lose yeah. because they were more intelligent than the black football players. Damn. So they had less intelligence. So they really didn't lose anything. What's CT? I got more for you too, it's, it's, it's Probably cranial something, something. It's, it's when them niggas just start losing. No, I don't want to see what the women mean. I don't want to see what they mean. They start losing their you know, that's when they started, the religion started spazzing out. Some, Most of them some, commit suicide for that shit. Yeah, some critical, critical, yeah. permanently. Yeah, yeah. Say, uh, it was a bunch of them. Dude from the yeah. 49ers. God, yeah. Well, shit, man. Some but it, but they, when you watch the movie with Will Smith, concussion. or whatever, concussion, uh -huh. they, 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 they leave tell you they've been new about that shit, man. Yeah, it was concussion. You know what that means? Chronic. Traumatic encephalopathy. You know, you know what I mean. That you were. Yeah. So check on to your like behavioral issues. Yeah, they yeah. get the, the trip, man. Yeah, niggas start killing their family. A lot of football players kill their wives and children. Yeah. And you wonder, it's it's no different from like you know them people that go to war and they come home, you know, traumatically just uh, tore tore apart. But it's the same thing. If Jake come off that shit, yeah, PTSD. 
Oh. And voices. They had voices piece, telling them kill shit. Yeah, there's so. all kind of things going on, man. They on those psych meds. Ew. Yep. And they broke too. And most of them in their contract, they broke, bro. Yeah. Most of them players, they Wait, broke. Like, that nigga, uh, Adrian Peterson. This nigga, <laughs> this nigga made a hundred million dollars and he dead ass broke right now. He running from a four million dollar loan right yeah, now. Yeah, he's <laughs> running from the people like yeah. he owe that. To too, man. To too. Yeah. Hey, and you sign a contract with the record labels just to get a million for the initial contract, but when it comes to what well, everything else, a marketing, you know, licensing and all that, they've got all that. You just get the initial money, money from the yeah, contract. Yeah, the first it says uh, imaging, con offset say they say you sign a three year deal. You saw it? Yeah. You signed a, a, a record label deal for five albums. Yep. You get a three uh three million upfront contract, and he said you don't get no money from the rest. He said it'll take about six, and you can't, there's a clause in the contract that said you can't make an album until nine to 12 months. Yep. And then if sometimes Jake be behind making the album, so he said you could be in that contract six to seven years to make the five albums you signed for the contract, but he said you don't get no money from that. The only money they get is what they got up front, like two, three million. Touring. That's all they got. Concerts and touring. That's like, but that ain't nothing, you know, them yeah. niggas blowing that. You no. Know? Did, did you see the you video just... where they had all the people that was like going in front of record labels and basically like promoting themselves, like their music and yeah, stuff? Yeah, yeah, come. That was that's the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. <laughs> it's it's sad, man. And Michael Jackson and Prince when we were going against the record labels and yeah, happened to them. <laughs> they often, man. And it is, it is. You, you, you don't do nothing to these people, man. Right? You always gonna get a uh, got more. Mm -hmm. like that he made me think about that scripture says that the borrow, the borrower is subject to the lender. So he, if you borrow from the guy that's lending to you, he's subject to writing the clause, whatever you want. Yeah, you so little fine, right? Yeah. You can do you whatever you want to do because most of you Jakes can't read. You, you don't even read the contract. You just go step in there because you heard a million dollars, you yeah. know. And the million dollars ain't shit when they get broken down five, six, seven, eight times. Yeah, you pay taxes. And... Yeah, just like in the NFL, you need to get paid on that Tuesday. If you don't dress up, you don't get paid in the NFL. All right? It, it's really nothing. It's slavery. Y'all heard that shit with uh, Jerry Jones, right? You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, Jerry, yeah he talking about old boy real bad, man. Oh, man. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah that's slavery, man. Yeah, you're talking about Dan Jerry Dan Jones, Jerry. Dan Bryant. Oh, no. You had you had you had Jimmy Fox was up there. Oh, yeah, yeah, Jerry Jerry Jones. Wow. They sit up there with Jerry Jones, but it's it's like slavery. It's how the slave master would sit up there and eyeball the slave you want to buy or the slave you already have, man. Big hand, show his guns. Yeah, it's, it's slavery. Hey, T Pain just T Pain just figuring out his contract from 20 years ago that. His upfront was forty million dollars or something. He just figured it out because he wanted to sell his catalog. But he said he had to go back and see what his deal was. Mm -hmm. And he's saying his deal from like what you know, T Pain probably like what 20, yeah. about twenty years ago. Yeah. He said he never realized what he was actually getting in this thing, and he found out how much they made off him and kept from him when he went back to track to see the seller's catalog and he couldn't sell it because he it ain't his. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't even his. Man. I was like, damn. The, the name of the artist is like an entity. Yes, it, yeah. it, it, it has nothing to do with the actual person. Yep. They own the name they, of the, of the yeah. artist, you know? What's interesting about that is now, you know, with this- Character. Oh. It's all the character, dude. It's, you know, they, 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 they hide that shit, they put that shit in trust. And all type of shit. You can't. You can't even sue. You can't do nothing, man. And they got insurance on it and everything. Yeah, you can't do shit. With that. They got insurance on the artists. Yep. That's, that's, that's the thing. And that's how uh, lately they found out a lot, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of the, uh, these places like the over that with Gucci man. All the niggas they killing all the artists and getting insurance <laughs> policies off these niggas, man. So go ahead. Uh. And what's getting so cold with it now? That's what these holograms and deep fakes, they're saying we're going to take, like, say, John Wayne, and we can make a movie in 2025 with John Wayne. We're just going to deep fake him because we own yeah. we own the image and the yeah. character of John Wayne. Damn. Yeah, we don't need to pay him no more. Yeah. So we just substitute all the people, and then we, they get actually all the money. 100% problem. Yeah, that's why they're known that Joe, as the tabernacles of bribery, they bribing everybody. It's all type of unjust game. Right, that's why they earned the names that they own. He's the thief, mm -hmm. right? He's story. 
Man, he'll try to steal the whole kingdom of heaven, man. Yeah. If the Lord and Yahweh shall want to rule he'll try to steal. If John saw the kingdom of heaven coming out, if Esau really had any type of, he could have an inch, a leeway. He'll try to steal the whole kingdom of heaven, man. Yeah. That's not like anything with it, but all right, well, look, this is uh, this is Job twenty and nineteen because he has oppressed, he has uh, forsaken the poor. Because he has finally taken away a house which he built in that. Mm -hmm. Nigga, just take anything. Uh, 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 royalties. Uh, what the other shit is? It's royalties and um, the rights. Yeah, the rights. Did he take that shit, man? And if he if he don't if he don't if he don't take it, he'll he'll get some other guy to take it from you too. Yeah, most of you out of the shit, man. Yeah. And he'll send your people to do it. He'll get yeah. people that you Dion sign. I get, guess what? Dion gonna start stealing from these niggas, man. He gonna you that because they use our people, like our elder always say. They get our people to come in there to make the deal as a mediator act to act as if he's on. Blow. Yeah, to soften the blow, just like them nil deals. They taking your name, image, and likeness. But it's, it's symbolic because in Revelation, they what? You got to you gonna have to get down to the likeness of this damn devil, man. You know? The image. The image. The ways. The ways, man. You're going to have to do that. All right? But that NIL shit, that shit wicked too, man. Anything yeah. with this devil, the scripture tells you. It's wicked. Uh, make no covenant with wicked, him. Make man. no covenant with him. That's right, bro. Yo, that's it. You ain't supposed to be signing contract deals with either my No man. contracts. All right? Freaky ass deals, man. You know what you right. do. <laughs> <laughs> and brothers, now the elder right and brothers, any of you brothers, man, don't be signing no fucking contracts, man. All right, no, yeah, what you looked into? Yeah, bro, know what you're doing. I believe all these everybody that signed contracts, our people, they're on the internet complaint like, man, I'm like, they took everything from me. Yeah. You know who wants to yeah. be? It's not for you to win. Yep. Only niggas that might have won. <laughs> I would say. Uh, Michael Jackson, and he dead. Jay Prince and a little bit of a uh, <laughs> little bit of uh, Master P, and they are gonna lose in the end. Of them. Yeah, them niggas, you know, them niggas brought off some deals that, that was unheard of. They came out on the other side, but most everybody else, they never signed nothing like that again, man. But they're not for you niggas again. They win. They for you to lose, and for them to profit off more, man. I said two and ten. Araji and depart, but this is not your rest. They got P though. They got Master P back. Cause he, he he put a lot of money into like Disney and different things, and they let that shit flop. So a lot of his business ventures and shit like that flop. So you know he had the hand in that though. Hey, 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 always selling noodles and fucking <laughs> cheap ass cereal. Him and, him and Snoop got the cereal. Stir up and shit. I can't stand <laughs> that. Hey, yeah, that's that's it, man. You get re reduced down to some some box of Cheerios. <laughs> Telling your son to go sell some goddamn bullshit college in the LA. You know that shit? What that shit was? The college? I see DC college. I see DC, man. Come on, man. This shit. Well, my son owns college. <laughs> 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 this is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. Come out of all this without him being a sodomite or something. Nah, I ain't hear nothing. You know, I ain't hear nothing. Wow. Yeah, but that's that just that's just you know the deals you gotta do behind the scenes with E, man. Yeah. All right, yeah. especially in that in that Hollywood Hollywood world, man. All right, the deals and some of the shit that's coming out. Like I, I seen some wild shit with uh that that guy Manny French said he did all them songs and baby only gave him a hundred thousand dollars. Man, man. <laughs> I'm serious <laughs> for doing thirty two <laughs> thirty two hours, bro. Yeah, God damn. But to a nigga in the hood back then, a hundred thousand dollars was a lot of money. Yeah. Did you say that? I'm thinking about the records he produced. Yeah. yeah. Some of the top albums. Yeah, I'm going to find that. I'm going to find that shit. Too. Sold like 4 million records. Yeah, man. Uh, uh, this is what the brother mentioned earlier. This Wisdom of Solomon 2, verse 6, which this chapter is the thoughts of the wicked. Their, their thought process. Come on, therefore, let us enjoy the good things that are present and let us speedily use the creatures like as in you. Yeah. There it is. There it is. Mm -hmm. And they strength. Oh yeah, Khan. He's a creature. And and they like to get Jake Young, cause uh, what his name on um, that that won the UFC? Y'all the night? Yeah, he asked. They had a, a, a commercial came on yesterday or something like that. It was press conference. 
And he asked, that a dude want to fight out there. He was like, how old are you? But he kept putting emphasis on how old. He's like, I'm 25. He's like, come up here. But they want to get you in your youth. Yeah. All right, why they could use you? Look at the uh, big really you, man. Bow Wow's, and the, you know what I'm saying? They go, they want you fresh, yeah. Chris Brown. Hey. They want them, want, want, oh, they, yep. you seen that with the Super Bowl with uh, uh Lil Wayne uh, snaking that. Yeah, <laughs> people don't want you, man. They don't you want you. Got you. No <laughs> presence, you know, used up, used up. They won't use you too. Teeth you know missing that. on the goddamn no. both sides. Yeah. People want your tired ass, man, looking like uh, with the gold bird. Yeah, <laughs> they want that, they want that young nigga from California. They, they want fresh feet. That's a beef. They won't use that, use you, speak yeah. like yeah. Diddy too. Yeah. They want big clothes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody want that nigga, man. You look like yeah. old. Hell, looking like old fucking rabbit fries and shit. You got no, it's, all right, people understand it. Yeah. You forget your lines, yeah. and you're so fucking high and drunk, yeah. and you get up there, you get up there dancing around. Yeah. I got some videos to show. Your pants are too goddamn tight. Yeah. Yeah. No and he saying. says, no, <laughs> what he said? He says, none of his songs translate to even that type of stage. Yeah. Oh, you know, like, sir, Beyonce, about stuff like that. Yeah, it's like drugs and. <laughs> They're killing and this killing dude. and with a froggy voice. <laughs> <laughs> Wearing the fucking Mega Man. Yeah. What you got to put on there? A milli, a milli. Come on, man. Yeah, nobody. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> nigga. yeah, has been. Yeah, he's old, man. Oh, and it's free. Bro, that, and that Emma said this too. Nigga, that dope been open a long time ago. And it's been cold. It's, it, that dope been, that door, that door of Lil Wayne been open. Yeah. And it's been cold as a motherfucker <laughs> for a long time. All right? So they were, like I said, he showed. Esau showed you he gave me got the young dude from California. Um, Ain't gonna put him up there on, on the front stage. Yeah, that's right. Yep. All right. Young boy. Him be yeah. a young boy. He could utilize him. Young. Yeah, never put him up there. No, I'm saying not in a Super Bowl, but yeah. using him as a young man to what? Capture the youth or go out of business. Put them there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> It'd be killing. Why do you, Jakes, are more than happy to, you know, sell your soul yeah. like just to. Yeah. For money, uh, you, you yeah. saw that uh, the, 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 that video of Bobby Schmurda auditioning in front. Oh yeah, we was dancing on the table. He a freak now nah, too. Yeah. They yeah. used them in this. Yeah. Yeah. He a freak. Yeah. All he yeah. thought was that. Even even that other nigga, Meek Mill, you you, you jumping like this, white. Yeah. 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 You see? Yes, I'm sorry. He done that. He yeah. used you as a human sandwich. You gotta yeah. eat right in the front. And you in the back. Then you... A human sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> That hands, that hands. Nigga won't go like that, man. Man, just dancing outfits for me. Dancing outfits. I hate you, niggas, man. That's all you niggas do. You get on them fucking yachts, dude. Put it all white on. You niggas get to jumping around, doing the, doing the, the, the most wild shit for these. Bunny guys, hop, man. huh? Yeah. Bunny hop. Remember them? <laughs> Back in the day, the day from me. Y'all seen, seen that made a nigga do it? Y'all seen that video? It made a nigga Nick Mill do the front flip. You know? Yeah. Hall? The, yeah. Oh man, yeah. some of the most degrading shit ever, man. They told this nigga, them no. white boys told that nigga, man, do a front flip. And he went Boom. and did a front flip <laughs> in the hallway. I said, man, they always had yeah, a six cool. game. Yeah, this shit, this shit is ridiculous, man. It's the shit that Jake would do for money. God. The shit that Jake would do to be in the status of in the in the in the social status of these people, man. That's why the scripture says, uh, is Israel a homeborn slave? Yeah. Why? Well, niggas, niggas is gone. Man. Niggas is gone, man. That's it. Look at this shit. Come on. Let me flip, brother. Mm -hmm. Man. That's when he jumped on the trampoline and stuff. Yeah. Come on, man. They went got stuff. They went got. They went got uh what LeBron James in high school, uh, you know, middle school. Yeah. But look at him now. They, you know, he, he fucking worn out. They about to get him too. They gonna get him, y'all gonna. They don't get him. Boys, they gonna get him. Yeah. Stinking ass. Can't stand that. I can't stand LeBron James. Nah, I'm about to see that. Ask her to do the party with his. With his hand. Oh, this way. <laughs> this, way. <laughs> this way. Holding you. Yeah, he's like, that's oh, hey, man, that nigga, that nigga sold out, man. Yes, a beam. Holding this opposite forearm, brother. You know? It's crazy. Hey, he is that. You got more?
Um, yes, sir. Just a little chapter. Uh, I'm gonna read ten. Yes. Let us oppress the poor, righteous man. Let us not spare the widow, nor reference the ancient gray hairs of the age. Not everybody. So they get young, then they get the old, man. And Bill Cosby was like, <laughs> got him young and old. Young and old. Yes. Uh, the boss yes. from the uh, yeah, in the party club. Uh, L.A. Azar. L.A. Azar. Because what they trying to do with L.A. Azar? Make him sell out. Make him sell out uh -huh. to make the youth uh, follow after him. He, he did the obviously man about to do that yeah, shit, man. Integrity. Yeah, he had integrity. He's like, man, about to do that shit. Go on, kill me. Yeah. All right, but you old niggas, you old niggas ain't, ain't worth it. Damn. I'm talking about the old nigga today, ain't worth it. Damn, man. Hey, they so sell out quick. You know, back in the back in when they were younger, they were against the alphabet stuff, but now they they for the alphabet. For the, for the alphabet they stuff, man. Do it twice, man. They all the alphabet. He did it twice. He did the Denzel just came out. And, yeah, and say, go kiss the man, kiss the man, and shit. Just yeah. say that for every like, guy omit it. Come on, bro. He yeah. next to yeah, he, 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 he a nigga that has some made it. He had and he wouldn't do no sex acts. He wouldn't do a lot of shit. Now he just he walling out in the, in the end. But like I said, he another guy. The reason why he was drugged up doing so much of this shit because of the things he yeah. he seen they had to do. Yeah. So he got back. Huh? He, was, he said I shot that dope and drunk, man. Yeah. The article he said I was shooting dope all my life, man. Yeah, yeah. Yes, I'm about drinking, drinking. I'm drinking <laughs> at least three bottles of wine a day. Shoot the dope, man. That wild, bro. And, and the kissing, I think you just said it. Yeah. He, he his whole career with him being a mainly man, 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 man. man could be his last movie. He's gonna be kissing a man in Gladiator yeah. too. Yeah. Uh, they made him do that shit. Say yeah. that shit. Then, it, then, it, then that thing gonna go dim. His eyes gonna get dim. He ain't gonna. He ain't gonna want no woman no more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that woman's the couple of most people. Yeah, they call it a beard. A yeah. beard. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of niggas. Yeah, Drugs and, and liquor, man. That's what they get you niggas like. That what that what that what baby got all, all the cash money with. Drugs and liquor and women, cars and clothes. Like, fake Geneva watches, man. Like that. Now you mad at Turk because nigga got <laughs> fake ass Geneva watches, brother. Yeah. Wait, bring bring it out. Yeah. Says, uh, he is grievous unto us, even to behold. But his life is not like other men's. His ways are of another fashion. We are esteemed of him as counterfeits. He abstaineth from our ways as from filthiness. He pronounceth the end of the just to be blessed and make maketh his boast that the Most High is his father, which we are. We're, we're the sons of the Most High. So they, these Edomites are going to always hate us. All right, we're never going to come together. And they're, they're always going to use, like the brothers have been going into, the youth. And the old niggas, man, because the old they influence the culture, and then the youth they they get the youth. Man. Kids can, look up to this. Like can, we all agree, can we all agree? Can we all agree that MAM was possibly a mold? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. No, yeah. yeah. Definitely. Yeah. 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 All of them. Yeah. All of them. Yeah. Anytime this nigga come out, I sold out my people. Look at that video. Yeah. <laughs> Back finger <laughs> down, shaking, scrambling and shit. Mm. Right before he went to jail, talking yeah. about what he did. Yeah. That niggas, that nigga was set up, man. Yeah. Bach was set up. Yeah, that's you, true. Yes. Generation X or Y, you you grew up looking up to Pac, man. You, of you know, course, that's, that's we're not gonna play games, man. He, uh, he was the man. Pop, he he was, but he was set up, you know. Then, then when he woke up to what was going on, because his video of that, he said, "Man, he said uh, Dr. Dre up there doing X Y Z to, to Quincy Jones." I don't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he, yeah, he's blowing rocks, man. Yeah, that's a big he did it. Yeah. Now Quincy Jones, now all the Diddy come out, Quincy Jones said, I'm just gonna die. Oh. <laughs> 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 I'm just gonna die. Hey, bro, it's been a month here since this nigga fifth. This the this the yeah. biggest yeah. music yeah. guru yeah. of that time. Don't feel no feel no well. Wow. That's crazy. Yeah, the nigga the out the Produce fucking thriller, man. It's the biggest album of all time. Yeah, had a funeral. They had a, they had a funeral for short and low. You tell me they had a funeral. <laughs> <laughs> it's a problem, man. Yeah, yeah. Had a whole carriage and everything. You know what I'm saying? He was a legend in Atlanta. Yeah. It's just like the biggest nigga in the world. He's on an island somewhere with, with Epstein or something. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Come on, yeah. man. This shit is a joke. This shit is a joke. <laughs> Niggas getting out the way. I'm talking about motherfuckers getting out the way, man. Shit. You got damn right. It's been a month. No funeral for this nigga. <laughs> this nigga was, I'm talking about big shit, man. Yeah. 
Man, the wrong about this intro. Like, sick, sick. You, know, you know the footage on there? Yeah, man. It's cool. I'm trying to say, he gets some loyalty. Look at that, man. Man, this shit, this shit, you got bust wide open, man. It's not going to be quick. Oh, okay. It's not going to be quick. Oh, okay. Go ahead. You got a little more, right? Let's see. You got anything else? Are you still holding up? You still holding up? Better than Jeremiah? I still have more than Sirac too. Um, I have one to back. Oh, <laughs> <my> two. <laughs> Got this. Get him. Get get Kalai. Got them. Kalai. Yeah, bring it out, man. This um, okay. back in that back in that uh, Sirac, uh, thirteen and six, and it reads, "If he have need of thee, he will deceive thee, and smile upon thee, and put thee in hope. He will speak fair, speak thee fair, and say, What wantest thou?" And when he and he will shame thee by his meats until he have drawn thee dry twice or thrice, <laughs> and at the last he will laugh at thee to scorn. Is it not they laughing at thee to scorn? It, it's, it's memes out there, man. The illuminator, the predator, <laughs> the dealer, <laughs> all type of shit coming out about this nigga, man. And then you, huh? No diddy. Yeah, that's a whole saying now. The whole saying now, man. Drive, 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 yeah, drive twice, then thrice. <laughs> yeah. That's what he do. He use you up, yeah. use and abuse you, yeah. get you to get into some act. You up there, bathing in in, in, in in lubrication and got you, bitch. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then if you ever buck up, hey, you know I got those. Oh, what? You know I got these uh pictures right here, right? Got that video. Yeah, you know, I, I, that video. Imagine how long ago he beat the shot of Cassie. Did they just they yeah, just leaked the video? They had that the whole time, man. But they could AI you. Yes. That's you. Everybody gonna say something, man. Yeah. You know that could be your face you, with a naked body. They just put you out there, bro. <laughs> hey, that's like damn. Good. The Epstein guy, man. He the he the Epstein guy. Hey, they want that shit to come out, whether he yeah. dead or not. I don't think the nigga dead. Yeah. But they got him out of here, man. Mm. And, and I'm talking about in a in a in a, in a secure cell. We had two cameras, <laughs> and the nigga still ended up there. <laughs> he, hey man, and this nigga had eyelids, not just yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, his eyelids. Yeah, what what what? The man I don't have the submarine to go to that bitch, man. Oh, <laughs> yeah. You know, you get on the submarine. Uh, uh, yes. That must be special. Go from one to the other. The last y'all was yeah. on that. <laughs> That's the top of it. I mean, the top of it right now, brother. Yeah, yeah, man. You did it. Damn. Damn. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, that was it. Right. I got a uh, oh. It was a quick one. It's just a wrap. 12 verse 10. Never trust thine enemy, for like as iron rusted, so is his wickedness. Yeah, I'm gonna keep reading down. Yeah, yeah. as iron rusted, so is his wickedness. It says, never trust thy enemies. Too many times, you Jake, you trust your enemies, man. Yeah. To uh, oh, this sign, that this sign right here, 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 and this shit right here. You never read this nigga. Is, he wrote a he wrote a whole a whole uh what's, what's it called? contract for himself. Yeah. Well, he's gonna gain in profit. What have y'all y'all brother seen uh uh? Straight out of Compton, right? With that gutter rat. Well, I will say Ice Cube smart up at some point, but what happened? Easy got fucked, man. Mm -hmm. You know, Easy got fucked. You dealing with a, a whole gutter rat. You know they gonna do you something wrong. Mm -hmm. They gonna roll you out, man. These lawyers, scumbags. Most lawyers are scumbags, man. Yeah. Most music executives are pretty scumbags, yeah. man. Like <laughs> pastors. Yeah, <laughs> pastors, scumbags. Scumbags. <laughs> Car salesman, scumbag, politician, politician, big scumbag. You know, doctors, scumbag, scumbags too, man. Wrong. Everybody that scumbag. runs the side, yeah. 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 scumbag, scumbag, biggest scumbag. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, we <laughs> live together. All sides, no matter who we go to, we gonna just ain't nobody playing fair. Yeah. Ain't nobody playing. Ain't nobody <laughs> playing fair, brother. You know. You go off, you go walk up to this nigga full of shit. You walk, I'm walking up to you. Yeah. Shit. This nigga ain't right. Ain't right. You know, go ahead, right? It's verse 11. Yeah, we got that. You just get down to the end. You want to keep going? Keep on reading, brother. It's verse 11. 
though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him. And thou shalt thou shalt be unto him as thou hast wiped a looking glass, and thou shalt know that his rust had not been altogether wiped away. Keep going. Set him not <laughs> verse 12. <laughs> set, okay, God. Uh, verse 12. Set him not but set him not by thee, lest when he had overthrown thee, he stand up in thy place, neither let him sit at thy right hand. That reminds me that in Jeremiah where it says, Why is thou taught the mm. wicked thy ways? Yes. You know, Jake, he's, he's back. Yeah, he's getting it out of here, man. Get it, get it. Dumbass I, nigga. Why you on? Um, we, got, we got five. We got, this is oh. the scoff one there. Yeah. We got 90 pages, man. Come on, man. I bet you he ain't nowhere in the cold, though. No. Nah. So he keyboard with the heat on. Shit. Eight to six. He got his Rudolph slippers on. More than eight for yours. <laughs> What's some Christmas cooking? Right. No, ugly ass sweater. <laughs> ugly sweater. But as, as I say, you know, Jake, Jake will teach Esau everything about him, thinking, oh, this is my friend and everything. Then Esau will take your identity, <laughs> take your talent, and say, oh, I did it. I did it. What, happened, what happened with the uh, the situation with the Wright brothers? Them niggas ain't had the uh, uh them niggas ain't had no idea of, of the plane. It was a dude, yeah. it's a dude way in Italy, a black dude way in Italy that had flew the plane way before them. What happened with the, the Model T? Light bulb, light bulb, yeah. Jake, Jake Ben had the understanding of how, how to make cars go in all some steam cars and shit. He uh uh the four dude took the shit, man. Mm. Then the to the, the make matters worse, all the cars he was making and painting, he was dumping the paint. In the fucking water behind uh the, the, the plant was had a chicken community in the plant behind them giving them lead poison and shit. You know? Hey, uh, 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 uh Jack Daniels. Yeah. The Jack Daniels liquor. Who 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 uh, made the Jack Daniels li liquor? Uh Jake. Jake. Took that shit, man. KFC recipe. KFC. Ain't no fucking Popeyes. white boy with white hair in a white outfit with a black tie yeah. on his neck. Uh, flipping chicken like that, man. They gonna need a real kernel. Yeah, you had two, you had two Edomite transformers. They took the Matrix from the nigger woman. Yeah. Then when they made their own Matrix, it was like the worst movie ever. Yeah, man. <laughs> that new one. That, that that's cool. Cool. That's right. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, yeah, that was the woman. The black dude broke you with the Matrix. I don't know about that. He flipped the roles where Trinity was Neo and yes. Neo was Trinity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See that. Oh, Come on, cool shit, man. Cool trash. Every time, every time. That no, they, they see no the goddamn gay matrix, man. Yeah. The gaytrix, <laughs> the gaytrix, the gaytrix. Gay <laughs> <laughs> gay and the whole, the whole, the whole green screen and the number going on is glitter. <laughs> it's fucking glitter fog. Nobody wants to see that shit, man. <laughs> Fuck the post, man. <laughs> That ain't goddamn did those for them, man. <laughs> Boy, I don't want to see that shit, man. I can't stand you motherfuckers, man. I'm just getting out of this shit pissing me off, man. The Matrix is a good mood. Yeah. Fucking it up, man. How you fuck up the Matrix, man? You know? Goddamn punks, man. Yeah. Huh? I'll be late. Yeah. I'll be late. Yeah. 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 Open intro is Diddy Harlem shaking. <laughs> 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 oh, shit, brother. There's a lot going on out here, brother. Wait. Hey, this is ridiculous, man. I'm oh, mad the motherfucker now. Nah, he's fucked up. Oh, man. I don't want to see that shit. Go ahead, brother. Sirach 12, verse 12. Set, set him not body, lest when he had overthrown thee, he stand up, he stand up in thy place. Neither let him sit at thy right hand. Let's yeah, because this, this this devil he didn't he didn't did that before. He he, he got us out the way and set up, set himself up as, as being us in our own land in our land. Saying that he is a, he is the son of the power. And all the whole time he's a goddamn devil, man. Yep. You devils you devils believe in Satan. You 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 believe in the top move, right? You a bunch of you 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 worship Satan. And then it have came out. They, they, you got plenty of countless number of videos go out there. These devils say we don't believe in Jesus. We don't even think he's uh, uh what do they say? We don't think he's the uh the savior, the messiah, the messiah, none of that, man. Messiah ain't came yet. Yeah. And you read that time move, man. That should have make your head fall off, man. Your hair catch on fire reading that shit. <laughs> That's some you know? Yeah. 
Oh, uh, <laughs> man should not lie with mankind. <clears throat> man should lie with a child, man. That's in y'all book. But every time you you get into a a, a, de, a, a debate or uh, dialoguing with these devils, the small hats, I'm saying, yeah. you bring that up. Nobody is. Yeah, why do you circumcise babies with your mouth? Yeah. What, what scripture is that? That's anti sim That's anti sim yeah, That's anti sim yeah, You're yeah. a Nazi sympathizer. Yeah. Who is she? <laughs> a lot of STDs was transmitted through that same yeah. practice yeah. too. Uh, yeah. These supposed to be priests. They spreading diseases. They did. They do not by the way that 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 facility in Atlanta too. Yeah, they spread. <laughs> they the disease. Yeah. They're the disease themselves. Their whole lineage is a disease. They come from out the Caucasian mouth. They bought the roaches. They bought everything. I was trying to cut off the long disease. They cut off a long disease. Cast. By cast. Not an earth. They don't block it. They the pestilence of the earth. Fire kills lepers. Yeah, fire kills lepers. Destroyed them that destroyed the earth. They the black man. Right. It's gone by the earth. You, you you devil's been doing this. You've been you've been doing your thing for so long, so where well, too long. Things things have come things have come out now, man. To the point, you know, you've been exposed, right? You're not you're not you're not the the, the, the true Israelites, man. Come on, man. What the fuck is he doing? He out here slinging number ice cream out here. <laughs> Selling dope, doing all type of shit, running, running red lights. Oh, you gonna turn fuck with us, man? Fuck out of here, man! Fine. Crackheads and every goddamn oh, thing. Joke. Yeah, man, ain't even no noise be around here. There ain't no real need for them to ride around. Huh? He just an imp in a monkey suit. Hey, watch, he gonna go fuck down there and walk, hey, walk up on us. Hey guys, what's going on? Fuck out of here, man. Fuck your mother. That's what's going on. Get away. I'm sure you got a whole half a bag. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking shit is kind of ridiculous, man. <laughs> All this wickedness going on, you want to mess with us, man. We, bro, we're in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Literally. Nothing going on around here, brother. Ain't hey, nothing going on. There ain't no bird out here. Just, just, just watch this. Just, just watch this. Just be quiet. <laughs> You can't hear it. It's not going on. A crime haven't been committed here since about 1925. Right here in this area, right? There right. haven't been one crime report. If somebody get murdered or somebody get robbed and they need the police. That, well, on the, on the crime was made, that crackhead left them goddamn toilet paper over here. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you right there. The only thing that's been left, the only crime that's been committed over here, the damn dog bowl. Nothing is going on. The brother thought a crime had that got committed, man. He had to make a crime. He ain't gonna shine a damn bright ass light on you, man. You know, but you ain't seeing all the all the. He ain't shining light on them back there. Yeah, but not Yeah, he probably. Yeah, he. Right, he gonna walk down over. He gonna go park down there. Yeah, walk. He gonna run over here, man. <laughs> right, nigga, you just gonna see that nigga running like get out. That, that black nigga with that cap. <laughs> 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 yeah. Like so why, why is trucky? Why is trucky came right there? Oh, yeah, that, <laughs> that's straight. <laughs> that T1000 run. That T1000 run, man. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just looking at you. Yeah. 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 You know, niggas in the pocket was coughing up last week. That same brown, hard ass jacket, man. Oh, yes. That jacket made out of that same material. Captain Captain America got that shield. <laughs> hard in the motherfucker. Go ahead. Hard in the motherfucker. Listen, you got to get some. You got you to gotta get some. Some type of laughter out of this shit, man. Some of this shit just don't make no sense, man. So there you go. Yeah. You got, look. You trying to see how you gonna creep down? Look. <laughs> he might pull the cuff through this. <laughs> <laughs> you got 
Turn the lights off. Turn the police. You right there. You thinking the niggas come over here? The levy police, brother. Yeah, and they the worst, man. Them niggas think they, them niggas think they, uh, Texas, Texas, uh, Chuck Norris, right? <laughs> yeah, walking Texas, right? Yeah. <laughs> they don't even get them niggas already when they come, man. I'm gonna be thinking even today, got a point three. I think it's got a hell of a business itself with your name. They got a radio. They got no, they got a radio. 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 They got a yeah, I think he's fed where the niggas is, you know, niggas be having a, a, a stuffed panther as a fucking police dog. Stripping, man. Stay. Stay. I see him. He pulled in over. He pulled over there. See, who knows what the nigga's doing? Hey, yo, 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 yo. That bitch been sitting there watching us too, man. That's like that one, only time. Yeah, that's the fact that nigga is now. I'm talking about that one down that way. He done. All right, I seen him pull in on the weed and commend the dogs from that Oh, yeah. <laughs> Jake, that bitch, Jake, he's coming on the cameras. Jake, big scroll with him. Oh, yeah. That's crazy, man. Okay. Uh, this is Surat 12, verse 13. Yeah. Who will pity a charmer that is bitten with a serpent? Or any such as nigh come wild beast? Question mark. Hey, you can't you can't pity these niggas because if, if you if you know what you're dealing with, you deal with eating my, you should know you're dealing with a, a top top tier predator, man, serpent. So who's gonna pity it when, when like I said, that, what that dude name was from Texas, up there, uh, 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 Lufkin, Texas, that got drugged. Who's gonna pity a guy like that? Uh, what the dude name was, man? You get it? It's been too long. But he, y'all y'all heard about that? Yeah, I heard about yeah, this. the dude got he he went to he went to the bar, started drinking with some Edomites, and next thing you know, they tying him up to the back of the hitch of the truck and drug him for miles, man. Hey, who's gonna pick who's gonna pick a guy like that? You deal with the devil, man. All right. The guy Emmett the Emmett Till, not Emmett Till, but uh uh <clears throat> what is it? Trayvon Martin guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Michael Brown, who's gonna do who's gonna fit it? You know, you dealing with the devil. Nigga got a gun on him, agitated. He's gonna he's gonna do you something, man. All your boy who was running. Remember he was running there, niggas in Atlanta? Yeah, yeah, the house, he was an house person who landed in the house time. What are you doing? I'm running in the <laughs> nigga, yeah, running in your backyard. Yeah, they're talking about they seen him coming out of the uh like you know instructions. Yeah, they, yeah, they, they, they come out of the houses what is he that? having the, the skeleton the skeleton of the house. Yeah, he was in there doing that stuff. When he was on a truck. Yeah, on a truck out yeah. of yeah. yeah, them them eating my them eating went back in time on his ass, man. They mounted up. Let that dude mount it up. What is that? Avery's. Avery. I'm just on the tip of my tongue. I know. I was like, think it was in Atlanta. I don't want to back. It was in Georgia. It was in Georgia. I'm going to say my bad. Like, he going up. It's important to hear that. Uh, Surat 12, verse 14. So one day, go. I'm just looking because I got. I can see. I can do. Yeah, he's following the camera. Look, man. That's how you roll that down quick. Right yeah, uh, Ahmad Arbery. Ahmad Arbery. Yeah, Ahmad Arbery. That's his name. Yeah, Ahmad Arbery. The guy that the guy that killed him, battered him for the cigarettes. So what it was? Yeah, he choked out. Choked out this for the cigarettes. Yeah, all, yeah. all the sterling. Yeah, all the sterling, man. Was, no pity, that. Yeah, you dealing with them Denham Springs white boys? What think gonna happen, man? Most of them cops that come out here as state troopers, them niggas be going in the springs, man. I think Eric Garner. That's bullshit. Oh, that's New York. A lot of other bad troopers too, right? Yeah, was, yeah, you can't trust them. Who had the knee on his neck? Yeah, right. Put the knee on his neck? He was a wearer selling cigarettes. Yeah, he got choked out. That was New York. That was Eric Sterling. All to Sterling. Yeah, then all you niggas go get that, what that nigga name is? Crump? Yeah, it is. He always eats leather. The black lawyer. He Crump. Crump, son. You all go get him. And all he's doing is making money. Of course. You know? It's all you niggas, you niggas are like, it then it got to the point where you're you're getting paid, you're, your people are getting paid for you to die, man. Yeah. All right? The lawyer gets money. Yeah. 
All right, uh, the, the press, some of the press that put you on TV to tell your story, the document, y'all get money. Yeah, for, yeah. Um, yes. and you lose money because you gotta pay. You gotta pay. They gotta pay for the barriers. We don't got yeah. money. That yeah. makes, we gotta pay to die. Oh, that was a that tree on Martin shit. That dude, that dude, that, that was a high level Mason, man. Yeah. Who knows that shit was even, even anything? He had that tattoo. He, that nigga was a, uh, 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 the range crack. That nigga was a crackhead, man. <laughs> Finny Floyd. Finny Floyd. Then this nigga, then this same guy was in Houston. Kicked in a pregnant woman door and put a, a put a pistol to a, a pregnant stomach, man. And then it's but they don't never see nothing about that though. Now they got a statue of this nigga. They got all type of uh all type of shit up there in Minnesota about this guy, man. It's a folk hero. Yeah. And then they got two niggas to tell Minnesota that certain stores in Minnesota were hit on purpose to the the basic gentrify the area. Now it's all white now, man. Hey, yeah, yeah. This this a white store that skip over the white store, black store, white store, white store, black store. They hit the black stores on purpose, man. And they got you out of that. They turned them all into goddamn smoking vape shops. Yeah. This devil, man, it, he cold with this shit, man. Yeah. This shit is cold. I'm talking about well thought of. I'm talking about this nigga is cold blooded with this shit, man. He smoke on his ops all the time. Every yeah. thing turned into a vape shop. He really rolling Jake up and smoking Jake every time in the vape spots, in the vape spots, everything. It happened out here, smoking up, up. uptown New Orleans, man. It didn't gentrify that shit so much. Yes, but you, you got the hood right here and, and five hundred thousand dollar uh condos right here. Yeah. To where now those yes. those condos through land value, what it does to your house, it make your it make your uh your mortgage your tax go up fifteen thousand, twenty thousand dollars. You can't pay for that shit. Uh, gotta leave. You gotta sell it to them. Yeah, and leave, and then they, and then, they it. then they come in with 20 investors, yeah. 20, 20 people all investing together to, to put in and just buy up everything, man. Yeah. Now you now you got you got Edomite jogging around the know you. Mm-hmm. That's right. You know? Where he say that they that whole way I mean it gentrified. Yeah. A million. A million street. <clears throat> right there, well, know your street over. By the dagger, you know the daggers yeah. like down that street, one street over. It's totally gentrified, like you say, eat them just once. Do you know what? You know what? With a dog, with a dog in it, yeah. The pool boy shop, man. Next me that pool boy shop. They put the shit soon. Looks right there on uh, what? What that is? Claiborne and and Walsh. Uh, Walsh, man. Yeah, that's yeah. fun. Stone park. That ain't for. You don't drink Jake. no goddamn stone. That's for eat them. <laughs> they don't know nothing about no goddamn uh lattes <laughs> and uh what the hell is she? You know, you know, you know. Don't know a goddamn thing. Cheese bands. There's a spot called Pizza Delicious. I heard of it. I heard. I can live now. You deliver them mm-hmm. like when you when you go on down St. Claude, all you see is the hood, like you know, just Jake oh, they, scattered all over the place. It, 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 the hood, you nah, it, make a right turn down one of the streets, maybe about three, four blocks down. There's a spot called Pizza Delicious, and it's nothing but Edomites there. Yeah, they have eight got like butter punk. Yeah, butter punk. Where's the bro? Area too. Where's that bro? Where's that bro that hangs out at the bywater? Where you at, I? You gotta watch out. <laughs> Take a fist of that shit. Oh, the real. Nobody wants to be from the bottom water. No. That's all throughout throughout that area. You got shithole Jake establishments there, but then you got mm. high end Eat Mike coffee shops, vegan restaurants. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man. They didn't they bought up everything, man. They really want you niggas out of New Orleans, man. Yes. They want to put you in the, back in the east. Now they didn't move you from the east to slide out now. Now they didn't move you from uh Elgis, yeah. Harvey. Uh, what is Marrero and West Vigo, man? Push on the east, uh, yeah. <clears throat> across the across the canal. That land, uh, that land over there is um historical. Yeah, yeah. That land. Yeah, I, I you remember Paul? Yeah, but he had a house over there. He the house he had was historical as a money. He like bought it cheap because yeah. it flooded whatever for ten twenty thousand and brother it was worth millions of dollars. He sold it for like a hundred thousand dollars. But after he sold it. He didn't know the deeds when he looked at the deeds. The deeds was historic. So a lot of that land back then, they probably that's why they probably flooded it. Because yeah, I why. think Trump had some had his hand. They yeah, he, had to make, that right. he wanted to make Trump travel, but what he yeah. was doing, he was he offering, land too. He was offering Jake out here if your house cost a couple two hundred. Two hundred seventy-five thousand. He want to give you twenty-five thousand for it. Yeah, just to get you out of there. Just to get you out of there. Yeah. 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 Y
Because if it were left with them beating bites, they'll, they'll have all that shit looking. they have all that shit looking good back then, man. Gone. See, you talking about the uh, you niggas? That's all you niggas want to do? Commemorate the night war? Oh, yeah. Like, like, people trying to get your ass up out of here, man. Come. By any means necessary, huh? They try to uh, buy land for that plant in St. James. Yeah, they didn't, didn't done that too. Uh, uh, yeah. past shell met in Bali. They just putting up putting oh. up this big uh terminal and shit, man. Oh, oh, chemical plants. Yeah, yeah. Chemical yeah. Chemical. Which you know they already got that cancer alley shit. Yeah, cancer. Yeah, cancer, cancer, cancer alley rules. Right? Yeah, this nigga, babies, everybody's catching cancer. Yeah. You know. Who's he gonna probably strike this video? You know, <laughs> we are we are not medical experts either. We don't we don't we don't we don't pretend to be medical experts. We don't know what the hell we talking about. This is educational purpose. This is fair use. Okay, fair use. This dude. We're not. It's been right for comedic purposes. Everything we're saying is allegedly. Yeah. yeah. We're not experts. This nigga won't stop, bro. That's blocking, bro. Yeah, we keep blocking. We block. Oh, he go. He just never coming. Look, you, it, he, look he, he on that again. This is nigga nine, 19 page, man. <laughs> With the same name. Page to make a page. That nigga. Page. Yeah, them, he got them bitches on. He got them bitches on. Page perfect. Tabs. He got the tabs on. Tabs. Yeah, them yeah. bitches. Wait, <laughs> Mike. You say he got the tabs. <laughs> <laughs> fucking nigga, man. <coughs> Somebody getting hurt. We had two, two. You got more? No, I said we had two out, two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you oh. got? <coughs> Child, I just got yeah. nothing in there. Get, get out of here, man. God. Yeah, Dre, come. Yeah, this is uh, Proverbs 23. Let's start at one. When thou sittest to eat with the ruler, consider diligently what it is before thee. As we, as a brother was going in through with Sirach 12, you know, hey, you know, never trust thine enemy for his iron rusted, so is his wickedness. You Jakes think that this Edomite's different from the Edomites 20, 30, 50 years ago when that's the children of those Edomites yeah, so coming back to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. And put a knife to thy throat if thou be a man given to appetite, you know. You got these lusts you want to fulfill. Mm -hmm. Esau's more than happy to pay you off to get it. If you got something he wants, yeah. he'll give you the world just to take the world from you. <laughs> Labor not yeah, to be like that guy Paul. They ain't mind giving that nigga hundred thousand. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah. yeah they, right away. He said he noticed the after and Lapana told him that high historical it was it was worth a couple million. Sold it for a hundred k. So you go to that same house right now. That's hundred ten thousand. Probably a whopping three three million out, man. Yeah. Ooh. All right. They get it. They get out the way easy, man. The Jake. You know, Jake can take anything. You know yeah. what I'm Quick flip. Yeah. He shit the Jake, man. Mm -hmm. Jake don't even know it has time. Jake don't even know his own value, man. You know, if I stall out right now, you know, I can take the, the risk of not yeah. getting anything. But if I do, I value myself to what it is. I could be. It could be, I could be worth more than what it is, you know? Totally. Jake, Jake just won't get it right now. Jake said with a quick flip. Yeah. He put about, paid about 10, put about 30 in it. Yeah. And then he like the 110 can, somebody want to buy it. That's 40, I'm getting me 60,000 or something. He like, yeah, I, why not? You ain't know though, you know? Yeah. Will be in my ass at that. Here now. <laughs> then he say he started checking the houses next to him. He see all of them, like, he was like, they, it was yeah. by no coincidence. It was historic. It wasn't even a block. He like it was the area, you know, like generally, yeah. Should have been there. Yeah, yeah. I sold it then. Yeah. Be not desirous of his dainties, for they are deceitful meat. Hey, Esau, Esau, make things look good for you. But what is this? Is ultimately to destroy you at the end of the day. What do you got to give to get? You know sacrificing family members your reputation your physical being your mental being yeah. it, it tell you some rocks there's no seeking of vanities in the grave man exactly <laughs> hey man yo yo you got there you're in the <laughs> grave <laughs> your backside man all right that colon no <laughs> in the earth man yeah. why would be damned if they're gonna do that man yeah. this nigga this nigga man this is a this is a cold sick world out here man these niggas are sick kind Man, fuck that penthouse and the pen the corner suite in the goddamn shit. building. I hope this shit. You gotta do some things. No, 
your your morals gotta go out the window. All right, <clears throat> your uh, manhood is just destroyed. That oh. goes first. <laughs> the more ma- the more manly masculine of a Jake, the more they can it. break you down. I'm gonna break you, man. And, and, and that's what they said about Diddy. Diddy took more. He the one dude said, "Man, I noticed this nigga got more. Uh, he got more of his rocks off. Uh, if a nigga was more manly, oh man, yeah, yeah, I get him more drill breaking him. Like you said, a guy like DMX, if he could, oh man, that is that nigga shut off like a rocket on DMX, man. Beanie Seagull, yeah, Beanie, them hard guys, yeah, yeah, he want niggas like that, man. That's what Moles want. Moles want." They don't want another mold. They yeah. want a man. That's, but that's E. He want like he want a fucking man. He is you. You the creator of that shit, man. You and Ham and them niggas, man. <laughs> <laughs> man we gonna throw all y'all niggas in the bucket shit, together, man. <laughs> y'all heathen, man. That's y'all. Yeah. That shit, man. <clears throat> Damn, Sadu means. <laughs> Verse four: Labor not to be rich. Cease from thine own wisdom. Will thou set thine eyes upon that which is not? Hey, it's said labor not to be rich because in this society, in order to be super rich, you gotta you gotta get down with the program. And if you're not in the program, somebody will approach you. Like we got a brother, we got a brother that's in in Lafayette. That brother, you know, in a situation to become a lawyer. That brother said they come to you saying you you in order to, to do this and to prosper, you gotta you gotta get down with with, with some of our clubs. Mm-hmm. All right, because everything in this in this society, just like the Roman Empire, was fraternal. Fraternal, it's fraternal orders over here, man. Secret orders, okay. secret orders, and everything. You got to get down with the program because it's it's. You want to become a doctor? Guess what? You gotta you gotta take up the Hippocratic. I think it's the Hippocratic. The Hippocratic. Oh man, Come on. same thing for a lawyer. Same thing for all these different uh. Fraternal order of the police. Yeah, all this shit, man. Mm-hmm. It's all it's all Masonic. In order to be a police and a detective, you got to become a Mason. You get when you go to the academy, do all them push ups and crawling, and you go to the, you go to the, you get usher as a police white, white gloves, <laughs> Mickey Mouse in them. What the hell on white gloves? Mickey Mouse is black and white. Yeah, that's his color yeah. scheme. For sure. Yeah. Now I, I go speaking it up now, huh? Now I had heard this a couple of years ago, but they said say you start a business and once you hit about a million, the Masons come to you. Look, you at a certain point, we're gonna do, you, yeah. yeah they come and up. if you don't want to get down, hey, your business goes away. The big, yeah. all of a sudden, you got break ins, you got break ins, you got the shit that's bad to catch on fire. Yep, all right, that's so, like the water bad. bill, <laughs> hey, the water bill is sky high. You know, shit just has so shit just start to happen, man. They make these dudes be a part of the, the system, man. Yeah, I'll get, I'll get totally lose what you have. Yeah, yeah, <clears throat> that's why you get them dumb ass niggas all of a sudden. They throw up the vi- the physical Pisces. They doing all so- sorts of uh, strange shit with their fingers, man. All right, it is, it is what it is. This this what it is. this this how you got to get down. I want to well, I want to do something on my own. Be an entrepreneur. Are you still a part of the system? You're still using their money. Yeah. Uh, Go to their banks. <clears throat> the baby, the rapper, he had an interview. He said the only reason why he ain't in that. Half a half a billion mark, cause they offered them. I think it was something did or some shit he didn't do. He said that did it or somebody offered them four hundred thousand dollars a day for the rest of that year, but he didn't specify like if it was April or what. But he was like, with the you know with the length of the year, with the four hundred thousand, he was like, that's why he got blackballed, cause he was like, nah, I ain't kind of with that or whatever. Like, but you know he still you in it some kind of way. But he was like, he turned that. He said. Push a button or two, I'd have been making four hundred thousand dollars a day. But what you think you'd have been doing? Yeah, man. You that's know, a that's a wild too. Huh? He, he was, you know, talking bad about them moles too. Them them bowls, yeah, huh? Yeah, he got it back. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He he got got it back. Get ass. About the baby, huh? Yeah, the baby. Yeah. Yeah, that baby would have been a toddler by then. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, man, that <laughs> man, shit, dude. So you still yeah. got down, nigga. You great, man. You should have just went all the way. They're the temple with him, man. They were trying to probably, man. They probably dead anyway. He did something. Yeah. You ain't get down that way, but still, you did something. Bro. Hey, man. Some sick, man. sick, sick, some sick shit be going on, man. And you did all that, that for this next verse. Wilt thou set thine eyes upon that which is not? 
Yep. For riches certainly make themselves wings. They fly away as an eagle toward heaven. As we were going into earlier, we, a lot of Jake's that so-called had money. Oh, was that Moses that said uh, about uh, doing something for a moment? Yeah, it was, it, that was it. Was in Hebrews. It was like instead of suffering, instead of enjoying sin for a season, decided to suffer with his people. Yeah, yeah man. This shit is a season. This devil had uh scripture <clears throat> tell you that Esau has a but a little season to, yep. to reign. Yep. All right. Yeah, I was trying to find out the wicked is short. Yeah, yeah. the pass on this world passes away. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this shit ain't gonna and Jake didn't slow all the way out, brother. Yes, brother. All right, all them Steve Harvey niggas, all Big them, team. all them niggas in that world, even <laughs> the Mike Epps nigga, the Mike Epps nigga know about the boy. Matter of fact, the Lord killed that nigga that was on with pop. him. Yeah, they were going to uh, uh yeah. everybody hates Chris. The Lord killed that nigga. He walking out there with the, the garments on playing. Yep. Lord killed that nigga. Then he made him run into the, the brother in LA two or three times. Hey bro, what you doing? I'm trying to talk. Oh, nah, man. Hey, Kashi six nine ran into the yeah. brothers in Hawaii and then all oh, oh, downhill from them. Awesome. You know, but we'll read that part again. Kind for riches certainly make themselves wings. They fly away as an eagle toward heaven. Yeah, the the riches in this society, and they, and they gonna fly away. When they change this money system, that all them riches, you gonna have millions on top of millions of dollars of debt, man. Some right, fiat you, currencies, huh? Some of them niggas don't even have that much money. Yeah, nah. they got a little bit of money, man. You Damn. you got a handful of them that really maybe have a little something. <clears throat> The Jay Z, you know whatever. Like, do you get all the people that's under them? They just got a, a little fame, and a lot of them niggas do to, do those sacrifices just to get on, yeah. not to be rich. They're like they're getting on to just have to a pick. pathway to be rich. Like you know, like that's shit crazy, man. Pass them around as a boy to make you, you <laughs> women. They do you so wrong. Oh man, yeah. they run, they run. Man, they run you women in the ground. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What diamonds? <laughs> you know. And fake diamond. And then, then you women today, well, Lord have mercy, y'all gone. In that in that world too, y'all gone. Yeah, yeah our grandma and them used to listen to goddamn basic grace. Come on. Yeah, and all them other women, chill, you niggas listen to Sukiana. Red. Sukiana. Yeah, you niggas listen to Melvin the Stallion. Pound time. <laughs> them you know, the wild motherfuckers gonna come out now. Gorilla, man. Yeah, gorilla and shit. That's a man. <laughs> Yeah. This shit is sick, man. <laughs> I'm just showing you. <laughs> That's a lot inside you. Oh, inside you. He just stopped. I can see him in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> Stars. <laughs> sick, man. Come on, bro. Like we were talking about earlier, you Jakes break your bodies and break your souls just to die broke. Like, you yeah. do all this stuff to get yeah. the fame, but you yeah. die broke. Oh, that nigga Dion said, you see that nigga hands? Oh, yeah. That nigga hands like everything going this way. Oh. <laughs> you see that nigga shit? Nigga toes, nigga man. Be talking like this. And that nigga just be, he's like, damn. Same sickle fingers. <laughs> toes gone. The nigga, nigga, yeah. nigga got, only got three toes on one foot, yeah. man. God, God damn it, bitch. I'm talking about toes, man. And all you can do is go to half that commercial. Half that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, that nigga sold out, brother. He sold out. That nigga sold out, man. Who was that one J? He, he had the football helmet with the chicken leg. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Who was that? <laughs> He was wearing a football helmet, Jerry and then the face guard it was a yeah, Jerry Rice. Rice. <laughs> Jerry Rice. That shit low, bro. Yeah, Jerry yeah, low, 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 man. Some of the shit niggas do just to just to get on, bro, or get paid. Yeah. It's just low, man. They get on with some people, like not even they want to be on and stay on. Just got a name now. Yeah, I'm trying to get a name in heaven, man. Got that corruptible crown. <laughs> you ain't even get a crown. You ain't get, <laughs> you ain't get the crown. You ain't get the crown. You ain't get. You ain't get invited, man. Most you got is a bottle of crown royal. <laughs> Verse six: Eat thou not the bread of him that hath an evil eye, neither desire thou his dainty meats. For as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. Eat and drink shall them he. Pleasures, them dainties. If I could say dainties means pleasures. Huh? You know, give we said don't give thy soul over to that which is uh that satisfied thee not. But those most of the time this is Jake pleasures, man, that they're giving unto man. Money, they, women call all the 
a lot of them say they just they just need to have the lifestyle. Like once they've been adapted or around it, they like they'll do anything to just stay in that lifestyle. They can't go back to another. Yeah, they five. Can't, yeah, they can't go back to the hood and this and that. So that means they're they're willing to sacrifice their morality, man. You got it. Hey, the words of his mouth were smooth as butter. <laughs> War destroying you was in his heart. And drink saith he to thee, but his heart is not with thee. Yeah. The the morsel which thou hast eaten shalt thou vomit up and lose thy sweet words. So everything he gives you, when he's done with you, you're going to throw it all yeah. up. And you're just going to be passed out out here. He ain't going to want it back like, I don't know. Like with the... When, when he came, Jew shackles back. Yeah. What is that to us? And then, then that's what most of you niggas doing. You niggas sell out. You selling out your lineage, your heritage. Your, oh. like, your, how would I represent us, man? We represent him. So when you do go and cross over that other side, you could been treason, yeah. right? When you deal with other images, other gods, you 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 commit treason against your own Yahweh Bashem Yahweh man. It's idolatry, which is idolatry, man. Made that covenant with death. You made the covenant with so yeah, it ain't gonna be disannulled either. Yeah. Lord gonna kill your ass, man. You got it. Yeah. Good. Hey, so with that. <clears throat> We hope you sincere Akiam and Akwat were edified by another camp. But before we get out of here, as always, we're going to give all praises, glory, and infinite honors. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. And peace and salutations to you, sincere Akiam, out there. Pushing this word and truth and sincerity to the four corners of the globe. May you brothers endure until the end. A Baba Ball. 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 Baba Ball.